<laughs> Mario fell asleep. Erm. Um. Hello, gamers. Uh, wait, talking screen. Um. It's me, Mary, your favorite American, streaming yet again. Uh, you'll be happy to know I did not spend time off stream gambling. Um, so at least there is that. At least there is that. Um... What? I dropped my controller. Oh gee, will it hurts. Oh golly. How can I get this without hitting my head? <laughs> um... It's time for the best chapter. Chapter... Four... Three... Three? Chapter three? It's so early on, and yet it's the best chapter. I mean, every chapter is still goaded. I just feel like nothing will ever top this chapter. I don't know why I love it so much. It's just everything about it is perfect. Everything about it is peak. You know? Uh, first thing is first, we simply have to go talk to uh, the leader of the Robos. Ish snail. Because we gotta learn about. Um. Dompiampa. I'm very tired, in case you couldn't tell. You want something to chill? This is the fortune of the Robo Thieves you lost. This is bring the chump like you to a place like this, say it ain't. Vacation. What if it is vacation, huh? What the fuck are you gonna do about it? Oh, and Sierra texted me pictures of Maple, and that's way more important than whatever I'm doing right now. She's just a silly little girl, guys. Maple is just a silly little girl. Simple as that. She's just a widow baby. Today is Thursday. I had to really think about what the day was. I don't know why my, my, my sense of the date is totally messed up right now. I don't know who I am. I don't know where I am. Um, I'm simply here. Okay. Anyway. The the pintas. The pi pintas. The pit. The pit. Pi. The the pi. The pinata. The pi. The pi. The. <laughs> Was that you want me that lion sheet and steal no good jerky for brains, Don Pianta? Real thieves like us end up poor as dirt and are catching a break because that guy. Did you come here knowing all that? Well, maybe you should consider a different career path then. Clearly, it's not working out for you. You know, scumbag demands protection money from us too, yeah? You know all that and you still want us to tell you how you can eat that crumb? Yep. 64 coins. Uh, sure. Yeah, I'll pay. <laughs> Wait, do I actually need to get 64 coins? I've never not had 64 coins at this point, so I've never... Uh, you really want me to tell you? Blah, 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 the scum of the earth. Um, forget you, pal. Don't want to pay, huh? If I no pay, no. oh, so I really have to pay. I didn't know that. I think I've just always paid. Damn, guys, we gotta make 64 coins. You know what that means? 
it's time to go gamble. If only someone didn't spend all of their money, um, at the Don Pianta parlor. Gee, Willikers. Golly. Uh, I guess I go beat up people. What if I know how to get in? Um, what can I purchase, ma'am? Ooh, I really want that. I'm leaving because I want- I don't want to be spoiled. You've never watched Chapter 3 of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door? Uh oh. What was that? I don't want the fucking weather updates! Every time I make that noise, I think that I've disconnected from OBS every time. And it's like, no, yeah, what? Weather updates are so much more! No! I don't want that, thank you. Alright, guys, I can do this. This isn't how I'm gonna make money, but I want to get the coins. It might be really hard because of the delay, and I can't fly as well as I used to, uh, or normally could. I could always just take the game off the stand and just fuck you guys. I already fucked it up. <sighs> wow, a whole net positive of two coins. Totally worth it. It's, again, a little difficult. Oops. Okay, new record. Okay, guys. I got a, I got a net positive of, of five coins that time. We're getting there. What if I'm I'm trying to go for distance maybe, and I'm not gonna get the extra bonus coins here. Except maybe this one. Ah oh, shit! I fucked that up. I can do better. I can do better. The thing is, if you're getting the bonus coins, you're like on the right path for how you should be doing it. Okay, I can do it. 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 I can get over 400. I swear to God. I already fucked it up. That's crazy. Oh my god, that was terrible. The worst attempt possible. <sighs> I need 60 points. I need the coins, whatever. Um, 
I fucked it up again. But that's okay. Okay, look, the net net positive of uh of of of, of eleven. I doubled my winnings. I just need to get two more coins. Easy clap. Get that far. How did you do that? I feel like I, if I go, if I try to go any further, I'm going to get the negative 10. How do you get further than that? What kind of witchcraft do you have to perform? I did like way worse. I did way worse. And I lost Pianta points from it. the hell I want refund though I need that I need it desperately I probably get this other places I, I don't know though. You know, as much as I've I've played um Paper Mario I just don't know anything. I'll probably look at my BP again. Yeah, I gotta make money so I can, uh... I can go get... I guess to pay off the guy so I can get the clue to how to solve the next part of the game. Oh, I forgot I have to check the board. Damn it. How am I going to make that much money? I'm just going to maybe cook stuff and then sell it. Or I could do- what was that guy's plan to make all that money? The little rat guy? Buy something here at this shop and sell it at the one in Petalburg, but I forget what it is. Maybe he's onto something. Maybe I need to do that. Just give me my tasty tonic and I'll go. Fresh juice? Wait a minute. Am I stupid? Don't answer that. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here to sell... Was it Sleepy Sheep?
Does that really not do anything? Five... Oh, poisoning and five FP. Interesting. <laughs> Alright, we're on our way to getting 64 coins, guys. I'm saving this stuff to cook with later. Maybe I should go kill people, I guess. Sorry. How many sharp pieces do I have? Five? I need to get some more so I can get, um... I got this one, right? Of course I did. Uh... Oh, and I have the fast... Okay, guys, maybe we should do the sleepy sheep thing. It was sleepy sheep, right? <laughs> Actually, I don't have enough money to buy more than two anyway, so... Okay, hopefully it was sleepy sheep or I'll cry. Yep, this is how people usually play this game. Mm-hmm. Yep. I could always do a few runs of the Pit of 100 Trials, I suppose. Here. Oops. Right, you just hit things with your hammer. Can't just shake them. Because no, I, that would make no sense, of course. Why would you shake bush? A hammer bush. Easy. Whisper in bush's ear that a second... Let's sell our sleepy sheep. Oh, wait. Whoop. Wrong toad. Okay, guys, it was the sleepy sheep. All right, we've made... We're four coins closer to our goal. We're, we're four coins closer to our goal of 64 coins. We're ha we're literally halfway there already. Um. <laughs> oh my god. So I'm just looking up the recipes a thousand year door because I don't remember all of them. Um. Don't the, doesn't this one not exist anymore? I'm pretty sure that this one doesn't exist anymore. So that's crazy that if you, the cooking of the honey syrup is the same as cooking a, a jam and jelly. That is crazy. Oh, we can go get eggs. I, I need more points. I need more points from um the, from the game from the gambling place because I need to get cake mix. How could I forget the cake mix, guys?
I think that's what I want to withdraw. Withdraw. When do I get the the pan, the frying pan? I don't remember. I think it's a quest, right? After Twilight Town. I can't remember. Yippee. Uh, no, 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 no. I want you to cook my fire flower. I won't be needing HP items. Well, I guess I'll need them for uh, my partners. I think I have, uh... I could probably get rid of some of this stuff. 6 HP and 2 FP. Sorry. I'll save this for a later time. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna store my, uh, well, I, I could always buy more life shrooms. All right, let's go kill people. Actually, we could do more, um, uh, uh, troubles. Cause usually they're like 30 coins each. So I think that would work. If only I didn't spend my money on gambling last stream. Ah. Yep. Time to talk to him, of course. I love talking to people. I can't believe I'm still like thinking about how last time for like the hide and seek guy. I, like, had never, ever considered just falling off, like, the back of that. There's, like, always a possibility that I did it, like, the very first time I did. But I've always used Yoshi to get there every time, man. <laughs> like a little idiot. Okay, let's listen to this guy. Well, well, Murphy. You must have gotten... Oh, yeah, so he's southern. He's southern. How do people in the south talk? Uh... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Truth be told, I've been a touch lonely here with no one to talk to. <laughs> Since you're here, why don't you relax with me for a bit, doesn't old Koopa? To oh, tell you the truth, I've got a few things to say about kids these days. Their tempers are too short for their own good, for one. Makes me want to give them a good stern finger wagging. Why, I was shopping at the Toll Bros Bazaar the other day. 
I'm trying to pay, and my coin purse was stuck closed, and the kid behind me said, Hey, geezer, want pay so we get out of here before the sun goes down? Now, well, I may be a geezer, but sundown was clearly taking longer than I was, clearly. Speaking of sundown, reminds me of dating the missus back before she was the missus. Always had to have her home by sundown, yes sir. Her pa was an absolute maniac. Yep, I'd keep my f eyes on the sun and off the face of my missus gentlemanly, eh? Actually, it was sort of awkward, kind of blind in a painful sort of way. Heh, <laughs> just thinking about it makes me feel awkward. Heh, <laughs> is the memory grand? But yes, know what I was talking about. Now, where was I? Hmm, oh, that's right, kiss today. They don't have my patience, I tell you. I want to stand up and yell, you pugs! Be more patient right now! Speaking of which, I think I proclaim my love for the missus in a loud voice. Yep, she was leaving on train and I yelled it from a platform like in a movie. Now, er, what was it that I yelled at her? Something about her shell, maybe? Oh, wait. I think I'm stripping my main point again. Or, wait, did I? And anyhow, me and the missus were madly in love head over her shells, I tell you. No, wait. My point was about what kids say, right? Ah, oh, whatever. Oh, my dear sweet missus, the way you comb my eyebrows with such tenderness. So, oh, sorry, I got distracted. Anyway, you get my point. Sorry I had to listen for all that. It wasn't too boring, though, I'd wager. I'm just happy to get a little FaceTime with the youth of today. Mario is a middle-aged man. Oops, I forgot to set out this he ain't I an old ninny. My apologies. In fact, I haven't even added the hot water part. Awful sorry. <laughs> Yeah, boy, if you cook a turtle leaf, you make some amazing tea. Oh, and you change your mind, you come back and listen to me at Yap anytime. It reminds me of, um, I just was thinking about the post. I don't even know what the context is anymore because it was, it's like two weeks ago I saw it. Uh, about like the, so were any of you gonna tell me that putting tea in hot water makes it taste entirely different? Because the person had been putting their fucking tea leaves in just regular water. That's that. <laughs> I I've I've never done that. I don't even put my sugar in when it's colder. I always put it uh like tea, then the sugar, then the milk because sugar doesn't break down the same way in in colder drinks either, so it doesn't spread evenly. So I gotta get liquid sugar in your iced teas, you know. I have a life mushroom. I want some insurance to me a life mushroom. I'm in no hurry, but something before my time comes will be nice. Please meet me in the great tree in Bogley Woods. Ah, uh, yeah, sure, why not? My voice is all scratchy because I just woke up. I'm an EP world guy. You know, I was an eepy little guy. I have it on hand, right? Epic. Okay. Thanks, I can tell by the fucking flooring. <laughs> Actually, that is helpful. Well, no, because the flooring, I don't need it anymore. But... I swear to god, there's a piece here. I swear to you. Going insane. Um, because before and like the other thing, even though I played it a bunch, I still would never remember which which pipe was what pipe. Let's come to the story to get an egg. Oh, Peony is always getting in the tub with the elder. It's no fun for me. Hey, Mario, can't you play with me instead? Sure, kid. Yes. Okay, okay. This is so awesome. Ready to play Stumpatoony? Ask any questions you want. There's no question I can't answer. Come on. 
uh, Mario likes which person the most? Classic. The person Mario likes the most? No, you can't stump the toonie. Mario likes Princess Peach the most. Well, you don't know that. What about my brother? That's my brother, man. Like... That's my home. That's my bro. Wait, you're the gen that said you'd help me out, right? I'm counting on you. I'm getting out of here so I feel like my life stream around. So couldn't you, like, live in the Paper Mario universe indefinitely having the life shrooms? They should just cover that in the next Mario movie. <laughs> the, the fear of mortality. Like, he has, like, a midlife crisis as, like, a plumber in Brooklyn. And he has to deal with that, and he goes into the Mushroom Kingdom, because you can't die, technically, as long as you have mushrooms. Hire me, Hollywood. <laughs> Hire me, Illumination Studios. And we did here made it before I actually did it. Phew, here, take this reward. A life mushroom is like health insurance. I'll live a long life now for certain. Truing 50 coins! Oh shit, guys! I knew I picked the right trouble. Now I can buy the the info I need. And then spend the rest of the money on gambling. Yippee! <laughs> wah, wah, wah I'm so sure there was a piece here. Am I insane? Maybe. Okay, hold on, I can enter the pipe, I promise. Now, I wonder what's behind the two boxes, though. That's, the, that's what I'm curious about. If, like... All the pipes are out there, where could they go? Probably just like treasure or something or items. Okay, I got your 64 coins, buddy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here's your money, punk. Yes, I mean, good call. You're a shrewd businessman, 64 coins on the nose. Okay, then clean those ears out and listen here. The store next to the Pianta Parlor in the west part of town buy a dried mushroom and a dizzy dial. You make sure you buy them in that order. Dried mushroom, dizzy dial, you got that? Do that and the shopkeeper will ask you what your favorite color is. Your answer is yellow. See, yellow is the password for getting to Don Scumbag's oh so comfy office. You got all that? Yeah. I'll remember that by the time I get there. Surely my ADHD isn't that bad that I forget by the time I get to the, to the area. I'm not even gonna repeat it in my head because I'm just that confident that I can remember it for 30 seconds. Anyway guys, I like never thought it would happen, but I finally ran out of credits in Honkai Star Rail. And now I'm doing like side missions to get credits to level up. I'm really trying to like level up my items and my gear right now because I'm getting my ass handed to me by fucking cartoon TVs. It's really upsetting. <laughs> I've been repeating it in my head, guys. I lied to you. Okay, dried shroom? Whoops. Whoops, 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 whoops. Uh, dizzy dial. Yellow. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Alrighty, mister, what color's your mustache? Yellow. Oops, what's wrong with me? That wasn't the right question at all. Uh, let's try this again. <laughs> okay, mister, what's your favorite color? Yellow. Uh-huh, well, you check out, you know the password. 
So I missed the equation of, of Don Pianta. Good for you. You think that maybe they're secret lovers? <sighs> I mean, he knows how to get into his, like, his, like, his, his house. I never use dizzy dials. And I never will. Okay, I thought I would get my uh, money back from that, but that's okay. Damn, I swear I could jump behind the counter. Could see that before from here. All right, guys, it's time for your favorite part my beautiful Italian accent. <laughs> Was with you, wise guy. I'm pretty sure I said it. <laughs> Because I was saying it the same way, and I remember. I ate too jolly today. If you gotta be spit out quicker, this is gonna hurt. I literally said, I literally, like, it's like the exact same thing. Like, I mean, how else do you say that? You know, like, that's just how you'd say it. <laughs> Excuse me, you wanna. You want me to give you a ticket for the blimp? <laughs> See, now to me, that's funny. You a damn comedian? No, you oughta be. You got some nerve asking me for that. I'm Don Pianta. I make crying babies weep. He's got the Dirk Strider sunglasses. You want I should run this bomber out on a rail boss? Look at him, what a rube. You must like pain, funny guy. You just looking for trouble or what? Not so fast, boys. I like this kid's gumption. He just came to talk. No, that ain't a crime. We, so we talk, you boys can wait till we're done before you're from up. Rough him up, you got it? <laughs> so I gotta assume you got a reason for wanting a ticket for the blimp out with it. I'm trying to save the world. <laughs> What's that? You wanna help some bride who got herself kidnapped? Yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> and to rescue this dame, you're out collecting the crystal stars. <laughs> The crystal stars. Hey boss, ain't those things in that legend about the ancient treasure? Vinny is a dope. Hey boss, this knucklehead believes in fairy tales. Uh, excuse me, but uh, that's not true. The treasure is real. I'm honest. Why do I have coops out right now? Everybody just shut it. I don't care if the treasure is really real or not. Get me? But I tell ya, I can't help but like a guy who wants to rescue some girl he's gotten gaga for. I made my decision. You do me a little favor, and you get your blimp ticket. Sounds fair, right? Sure, we can do anything. But what is it? It's easy, it's nothing. It's, it's less than nothing. It's easy peasy, lemon squeezy. See, the, the thing is, my own daughter. Elope with one of my young associates. They vanished, but it wasn't too long ago that they did. They ought to still be in town somewheres. I swear they do I don't remember having this many days. <laughs> you gotta find my daughter, Francesca. And this Frankie. And bring both them here. And bring them both here. If you're unable to bring them here, then all you gotta do is tell me where they are. And I shall settle this matter quickly, and with the, what is known as extreme prejudice. Boss! We don't know nothing about this guy. You can't rely on some goofball for this job. Yeah, boss, and he's right. Leave it to us to find Francesca. Quiet, you! Because you looks can't find her, I got that. I got swallow my pride and ask this guy. Oh my god, look at the, the extra animation. It's awesome. I hope you dope say making complaints about my decisions, you making complaints. No boss, whatever you say goes, boss. I don't know what I'm singing, boss. I won't happen again, boss. You the boss, boss. Good, I'm glad we're full of an understanding for one another. 
<laughs> so settled the F by my daughter and her friend then come see me. Francesca and Frank, you look like this. Okay! I just so clear here, if you don't find my daughter, your luck may turn terrible. What if I just, like, never came back? Like, it took me, like, 18 hours. I mean, what would he even do? He couldn't do anything. He's not scripted to. What's he gonna do to me? Hmm. I could go for some royal milk, uh, royal milk tea right now. I love royal milk tea. If I talk to people, do they know where they are? I never... But then we already deal with your credit card fraud, buddy. I think they're here, right? do that every single stream or something like am i contractually obligated to jump into a void every time or something like i don't understand really like how do i manage to do that fucking like every time guys hon i see they got um some i'm gonna get some milk <laughs> really quick I'm really thirsty, but I'm also hungry. <gasps> I get chocolate milk! I didn't make myself a chai latte, but I can get chocolate milk. Way better now. Okay. It's also a nice, cool 78 degrees in my room. I just needed to do that because I'm doing a lot of Italian voice acting, and I really just like I need I need uh, the sugar <laughs> to get me through all this Italian. You know? 
guys ever been to one of my family gatherings, you you get it. Hey, back off, you creep! You want something, or you just like sliding up to people? Oh. What? Daddy asked you to find us. They take us to him. Frank, you wish we do. Daddy finds us now. Oh, I don't know. And the boat's coming any minute. <laughs> Dollface, face, maybe we ought to head back and try to talk to the boss one more time. No, Frankie, don't say that. Don't you know what he'll do if, to you if we don't if we do that? I can't read. <laughs> Cheska, baby doll. If we can just talk calm like with the boss, he'll understand. Look how emotive she is. I'm just like, yeah, I know what they tried. This is, it looks really awkward. Like, whenever they fight in Boomba, they tilt their head. Gosh, it looks bad. I like them. What? Fuck you. <clears throat> She's a hater. Oh, Frankie, my Frankie, don't you love me? <laughs> of course, I love you, sugar cookie. <laughs> More than anybody in the whole world. I think this music's new, too. I remember this. Beautiful, lovely music playing. <laughs> then let's go, Frankie. Let's run to the ends of the earth if we have to. <clears throat> but Butter Biscuit, they already found us. We can't keep running forever. We can't, Frankie. The more you try to put out the flames of love, the hotter they burn. Until I marry you, no one will extinguish these flames of passion. No one. Don't you see, mister? I beg you, pretend you never saw us. Can you do that? Of course. <laughs> of course! <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. You're swell, mister. You're a real stand-up guy. Alright, guys, let's go tell, uh, let's go tell Don Pianto. Um, what should we do? I mean, I guess we should tell Don Pianto something. But I... I don't want our luck to turn terrible, whatever that means. No, we're gonna tell him the truth. Guys, Ovaltine is so fucking good. Uh, also, let me fucking get Goombel out. I'm tired of this fucking coward. You know, I like using my normal voice for talking and not... Um, guys, like, are you, like, sure we should, like, fight? Guys, I'm, like, scared, man. <laughs> you know? Oh! That was a weird coincidence that I happened to hammer that exact moment. I almost forgot about that one. They're by the pier. <laughs> oh, look who's come back. The proverbial mustache. You gonna brighten my mood? <laughs> so give what you got, you know, whereabouts the two runways. Yep. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, that a true fact, Roport Harbor, huh, eh? Well done, I appreciate this favor you've done for me. I'll prepare your blimp tickets. <laughs> hey, hey, you two Nimrod, the kids are at the harbor. Go Now go get them. Daddy, wait! <laughs> <laughs> Francesca! <laughs> boss, forgive me, boss. I I'm sorry. I truly, I am. <laughs> Frankie, so you... So back you come, head hung low, and with your tail between your legs. <laughs> <laughs> no, Daddy, don't hurt him. I know who said we should elope. It was me. Well, Frankie said no. He said we should come back and talk to you, Daddy. Boss, listen, I don't care what you do to me. I deserve it for being... I deserve it all for being disloyal. But you gotta forgive her. Forgive your daughter, boss. That's all I ask. No, daddy, no, no, no. I'm the bad one. It's my fault. If you're gonna punish anyone, punish me. No, boss, it's all on me. It's my responsibility. I'll to blame right here. 
daddy. Boss. <laughs> Enough quiet, both of you. The Francesca, my headstrong daughter. You used to be your last favor long ago. And you, Frankie. You were like a son to me. This is how you repay your debt to Dom Pianta. Feels this disappointment in you too. Like it's like a poison mushroom in my gut. Daddy, boss. I don't want to ever see your mugs again. You hear me? Get out of my sight, both of you. I don't care where. Just go. This is what you expect me to say, huh? Well, that's what I'm saying. Go. Do what you want. Even if it means getting married. Oh, daddy. Dad, no way. I mean, boss. Thank you so much, Daddy, and thanks for your blessing. Boss, make your daughter your hat. Look how, I mean, look how emotive they are now. You know, the, the angle? It's so much more uh, intense, you know? Boss will make your daughter a happy woman. I promise you she'll want for nothing. <laughs> Enough already, just go. <laughs> Francesca, seeing you this ha happy makes me happy too. Congrats, both of yous. Frankie, this is great. I mean, the way this all turned out is a bit sappy, but hey, things are that okay, am I right? Good boy, Daddy. Farewell, and thank you. I mean, like, no wedding? No big Italian wedding? No big fat Italian wedding? <laughs> I've never seen the movie. How do you say you can't remember the name? My bad. You still here? Yeah, I need my ticket, buddy. <laughs> well, you found my daughter. And got her to come back here. <laughs> and just look at how things turn out. What a complete nutter soap opera. <laughs> but hey, deal's a deal. You can take have your blimp ticket, like I said. Yippee! <laughs> Who knew? And that guy's got a smile and ear to ear. She's happy. That's good. <laughs> Hey, I knew you were the right man for the job. Thanks a bunch, Pally. <laughs> and now go get your ugly mug out of my office. I got some intense emotions to compartmentalize. <laughs> Yay! Awesome, we did it! Now we can go to Glitzville! Mary's not blimp certified? Yes, I am. You don't know that. Me- with me flying a blimp, what could possibly go wrong? Nothing. <laughs> My life has always been smooth sailing, and I certainly wouldn't cause us a disaster. That's not in the merry lore. I don't need money, money, because we're not going to be doing, like, any fighting outside of the ring, so... This fight goes to Glitzville. You will need a ticket to travel with us. No problem, I got my ticket right here. Yep. Let's go! Come on. There's Maple! Here we go, guys. The best chapter. Imagine if Twitch currency was, like, cryptocurrency. That would be funny. Like, Twitch points for cryptocurrency. I mean, there technically are, if you think about it. They're just not worth anything outside of my currency system. What you doing, Maple? Will 
Will I do the music thing? It's doing it, I think. Nice. So I'm not insane. Or maybe I am insane. It's still playing this song, so maybe I'm insane. I'm insane, guys. I'm insane. Just me and my three partners. Probably not. I mean, I probably will be. I have an addiction to Bellow. Should I be? No. No doubt about it, this is Glitzville. Can you believe it actually floats? No, I can't actually now that you bring it up. Well, let's get to it, huh, Mario? Let's find that crystal star as fast as we can. Okay. It's gonna be. This is like the longest chapter, too. Sorry. Yippee! Where the world wanders, the traveling sisters three, usually. But here in Glissville, we're the rough and tumble, battling and traveling sisters three. Okay, sure you are. Oh, look, you can see inside the shop from the windows. so much more sense than that how it originally did. I don't know if it's just because like the animations are like smoother or like more clear that I like because this could have happened. Can hold their breath longer than dolphins. Sloths can hold their breath, uh, slow their heart rate and re hold their breath for up to 30 minutes. And this guy. There it is. Oh my god. purchase I'm gonna need a bunch of these point swaps for later but I don't have any money right now uh we'll come back here later I guess let's go hang down the clouds I'll give you two guesses why I like it here how'd you get up here then How'd you get up here? Maybe she was born here and has never left. <laughs> Haven't seen your face around here and I know I'd remember a stash like that. Listen guy, if you want to see a match, head on inside, it's the Glitz Pit.
guys, I got in so good doing that voice, like, without, like, any struggle. Oh, you don't have to tell me about ducks, okay? I know a lot about ducks and how evil they are. Bonjour, Monsieur de la Moustache! From this place, right now I am loopy with love for that ravishing creature over there. She is a sight to behold and I saw her Okay. That fabulous mustache. I've seen it somewhere before. I know it. Yes, Mario, that's definitely a name I've heard somewhere before. Hey there, welcome. Our doors are always open for thirsty, thirsty fight fans. So grab frosty juice, take a load off, and enjoy. Today's main event will rule. I'm betting on Rock... Rock Hawk. No matter who's fighting him, why did they name him? <laughs> uh, you, look, you don't look very familiar. Are you on vacation? Me? Just a lack of who digs on combat sports, dude. Nice meeting you. <laughs> rock Hawk, you know? He's a hawk that rocks. You know? <laughs> <laughs> it's something you would fucking say, like, like it's like a fucking Wendy's nuts joke type beat, you know? Like, why'd they do that? Like, did they, like... Come on, man, Rock Hawk! Like, I can't, like, hello? Can't say it! <laughs> And the worst part is the first time I ever streamed this, or I guess it was the second time technically, I like didn't even like notice. It wasn't until last time when I streamed this that I realized what the fuck it sounds like. Hello, Mr. Mustache. We meet again. Okay. Spence, here, savage battles go on each and every day. Oh, hello, you big burly hunk of man. You're smashing, dear. But if I'm only interested in the champion Rockhawk, toodaloo. I just, I just, I just, I'm gonna stop saying it, I think. Yo, out of the way, pal. I don't do stories on nobody. Sorry, move it or lose it. Move to one side, small fry. The only thing my camera shoots is famous athletes. <laughs> I don't know if that's the little guy I was talking to or the older guy. Huh? Wow. This game is full of weird things, man. I wonder if he's got like a similar name in um in Japanese. Like what's the Japanese translation of it? Is it also sussy? Look, it's spelled, it's spelled rock, it's spelled, it's spelled like this, just so you're aware. It's not like rock, R-O-C-K, R-O-C-K, it's R-A-W-K. <sighs> Who did this? I just want to have a word. Hey, how you doing, bud? I'm a freelance cameraman. I'm always after a scoop.
There he is, the famous Rock Hawk himself. Whoa, totally awesome. Check it out, Mario. Someone's about to catch a beating up there. It's right on. I think it's about time for you to feel the rock. <laughs> Stay down, pincushion. You don't want more of this. Why do you even show up? Yeah, you hear me talking, Wimpy? Stay out of the ring or feel the burn, baby. Tell you what, do about a million push-ups and come see Uncle Rockhawk. <laughs> I'll give you a world-class spanking instead of crying ho home to mama again. Hooey, <laughs> Tam, that was a great A whooping. Your thoughts on the match? You call that a match? Ain't there a fighter out there who could challenge me? No, no one can hear me, and a fighter out there that can make me sweat. You got a bone to pick? Come fight me, I'll bring it, I'll take on anyone. You weaklings might as well stick to video game fighting, okay? Cause I'll hurt you. Yeah, number one, baby! Rockhawk is the champ! <laughs> Whoa, look Mario! There on the champ spell, isn't that the- isn't that a crystal star? I doffs to believe it is. Yeah, yeah, totally is. Look at that sparkle. Gotta be a crystal star. Why would that be in a sweaty old pit like this? <laughs> Spanking with rock hawk. <laughs> what do you think we gotta do? We can't just steal that meathead's belt, can we? This stinks, what do we do? Uh, battle our way to the top? Duh. There you go. You and I are like... Totally on the same exact wavelength. Crack a few heads, take a few names, become a champ, and nab that belt. Oh, yeah. And beat Rockhawk. <laughs> so let's get busy, huh? I guess we gotta become official battlers first, right? Oh, I'm kinda getting stoked about this. Let's go find out who runs the shindig. When I get older, I'm definitely gonna be a pro fighter and make the loot. I'll burn that belt in five years, Max. I know it. Believe it. Believe it! Fuck you, so that's fine diamonds in the rough. Why do you got the fans like. The fans like fighters to crank that bitch around us. What? Sure, by way to avoid losing the ring, wanna hear it? Sure. Sorry, I didn't hear that. I had some cloud in my ear anyway to avoid losing. Don't get in the ring. Come on, that was hilarious, wasn't it? I thought of that all on my own. <laughs> Do you like Rock Hawk? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Rock Hawk is my favorite character <laughs> in the game. What's that bubby one from fire? <laughs> well, if you're serious, you better go meet up with Mr. Grub at the promoter. <laughs> We're in the shadow of the hedgehog meme. <laughs> Mr. Grubber's office is just down the hall, but you can't miss it. Head on through. And the time you look up nice cock, of course. How could I forget? I think you could, in fact, miss it, to be honest with you. Hot dog. Yeah. I want to get a picture of Shadow the Hedgehog saying nice cock, okay? And I learned that day you can't just Google a nice cock. That's my bad. What's that? You want to be a fighter, bub? All right, go in. Mr. Grub is just inside.
Who in tarnation are you, son? Who let you in? This is Grubba's office. Yep, that's me, Grubba. You're one rude dude coming in without knocking. Uh huh. Uh huh. What now, an athlete, huh? You wanna be a fighter? Woo wee! I do change a thing or two, son. I always got time for an up and comer. Yep, this place is packed the gills with young fighters all primed and a raring to go. I gotta say, son, you're a bit skinny for my taste, but I'm willing to give you a shot. Now, play me straight, son. You wanna live the glamorous life of champ, don't ya? Darn Skippy! Alright, alright, son, I hear where you're coming from, loud and clear. Yay. When I was just a poor pub, I didn't give pokies patoot for fancy big city ways, but I jumped into the world of martial arts and found my way to fame and riches. And what I realized? Being rich and famous is diggity dang dynamite. Now, I can't mix it up in the ring no more, but I earned enough to set me for life. You read me here, son? Dreams do come true, even if they ain't yours exactly. Yep, that's the key, son. Dream big and it'll get big. That's the winner's way. And when you make it big, you'll look back at all those small dreamers and laugh. You reading me here, son? That's Spirit Chief here. Let's have a little walk and talk. Come on now. I be don't gotta convince me, man. I'm ready to go. Like, sign me up, buddy. Now how'd you like this part? Just feast your eyes, go on. This is the champion's room. Isn't a sight? Deluxe. You become champ son and you get the key to this room. That ain't all, of course. That's on top of the big money and screaming fans. Yeah, no doubt about it, son. Apply yourself and a life of wealth and comfort awaits. Do I get to keep the picture of Rock Hawk on the wall? Uh, now, uh, here we have the Major League Locker Room. A lot of contenders here. What do you think, son, huh? Not exactly glamorous, but it's clean and comfortable. Hey, totally sanitary, too. Maybe I'm old-fashioned, but I care about my fighters, darn it. Now, I'm sure you know this already, son, but there ain't but one world champion. Climbing away to the top and taking the belt to become champ ain't an easy thing. But that's the point, son. Wouldn't be worth it. Worth it if there weren't no challenge. I can see you got the fire for a two part. You got the eye of a tiger there. If you're gonna be champ, I can just feel it. I ain't never been so sure about a fighter. Oh, hey, one other thing. You gotta sign an itty bitty contract to be a fighter. It ain't no thing. Just take a second to your time. Just jot your name here, okay? Sign me up. Send the contract. Best thing you ever done, son. Now, Mar now your Mario ain't a bad handle. Still gotta say, pard. It lasts a little punch as a fighter's name, get me? Let me see here. Bam. Hooey! I got it. From now on, you're gonna be the great Gonzalez. Who ain't it a beaut? I love how Mario just like every single chapter just has his name like incorrect basically dang they ain't a stroke of genius a name that good comes around once a lifetime yeah sure yep everyone will soon bow before the great gonzalez make me proud son but like why like how do you get that there from mario did you know as a child i used to pronounce it gonzales Well, now we got the business side out of the way. Jolene, could you come in a minute, darling? Yes, sir, you wish to see me? Sure did, hun. Jolene, this is the great Gonzalez, our newest rising star. Be a peach and take him down to the minor league locker room, alrighty? 
Right away, sir. <laughs> Mr. Gonzalez, if you would be so kind, please follow me. As you know, you are a contracted fighter now, so you must abide by some rules. First and foremost, what Mr. Grubba says goes, period. He must do what he says. Also, as per your contract, you cannot quit until Mr. Grubba releases you. There are many other small guidelines that I will explain as become relevant. Well, here we are. This is your locker room. starting the Meyer League, of course, and you've just now started your career. If you don't like this dingy room, the dingy room, I suggest you work your way up through the ranks. When you're ready to fight, you're logging this computer terminal here. Mr. Grubble will then decide who he'll match up against. You will have no say in this. Why don't you try it once? Walk up the screen and log in with A. Then pick rank match. Welcome, I made a match with the racing system. What is your command? Well, howdy, Gonzalez. Ready for your fur to get your fist dirty, huh? There you go, son. I got a treat for you. Your first battle is gonna be against the Goomba Bros. Don't worry about them. They'll be a piece of cake. Just mop them up, okay, son? Hey, want to get everyone fired up though? So peel the crowd at least once. You got any questions about detailed rules? Just ask the lovely Miss Jolene, okay, son? Well, good luck, pard. Okay, your battle's reserved. At this point, you just wait until security comes for you. Fighting is pretty basic. The team that drops the opponent's HP to zero first wins. Simply winning is not enough. When Mr. Grubba sets fight's conditions, follow them. In this case, the condition is to appeal to the crowd at least once. Fairly easy. Satisfy the condition and win, you can battle a higher ranked opponent next time. If you lose the match or don't satisfy the condition, your rank will stay the same. If you can get your rank up to 11th, you'll get a shot of the Major League. That's about all you need to know for now. Do you understand all that? Okay, good. For now, just wait until security comes to get you, Mr. Gonzalez. Take care of yourself, man. Don't make any rookie mistakes, know what I mean? <laughs> Gonzalez, match time. Follow me, bub. Okay, security's here to escort you to the ring. Time to take it completely destroyed out there. I won't. If you have any questions, feel free to bomb ask me. I rank after you I outrank you after all, bomb. Rick, most dash is a fighter. <laughs> I do wanna go out for my regular stroll soon. Okay. Shut up. All right, let's do it. Look, they have their hands behind their backs now. That's cute. All right, time to own these assholes. Scoring off next, folks, are the meteorite hardheads, the Goomba Bros. And a newcomer with a hankering for hammering, the Great Gonzalez. The Goomba Bros have been waiting and getting all head up for the fight. Let's check in. Head up? What the hell does that mean? How do, Goomba Bros? How are y'all feeling today? You ready for this fight? Ha! You kid me, man? We're always ready to bong a fool or two. Who is this Gonzalez rookie? A cocky idiot, that's who. Waiting just makes me makes us mad. We're gonna teach this party punk how to respect fighters with seniority. I think maybe you ought to call an ambulance for him now, just to save time later. Truing. Hot diggity dang, fight fans! There's the great Gonzalez now, striding on up. I tell you, this rookie's got some guts, strolling up late like he owns the place. That's because I was talking, sorry. Okay now, Gonzalez, listen up. Let me just explain the rules of the match real quick. Have a bonk punk. Damn. That's crazy. And I let him hit me. Hey, those total cowards. Those chickens attacked us before the bell rang. Oh, that's it. Come on. We aren't losing the punks like them. Let's waste them. Aw, oh, quit crying, will ya? That was just a little welcome gift for the rookie. Where's our thank you? 
over one supporter. Uh, I want that. Cause I'm streaming earlier than I usually do. I only get viewers this early if I play Valo. <laughs> Do I play camera on? Oh, sexy. Oh, good, they have like a little reminder of what you have to do. That is actually really helpful because I always forget what I have to do. Owned. The great Gonzalez wins, tells me some. What was this first day's victory like? <laughs> that fight? <laughs> what a joke. Yawn. Listen, this guy, he's like a poet of the arena. I'll tell you what I saw. I just saw folks a whooping. This kid's got skills. We got ourselves a new hero. Let's hear from folks. Yeah, the great Gonzalez. I wonder if the crowd will get louder as I, like, progress. Because that was a weak-ass crowd. Not too shabby for his first fight, Gonzalez. You got some promise. Anyways, I'll be heading out now. Go get your fight money from Jolene. Money! Here's your fight money of five coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Yay! I love money! Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Next fight will not be set up until you select rank match on the terminal. Three AFKs is crazy. Let's see, you have another 60 kills, buddy. You can also check your current ranking on the terminal screen. Feel free to do whatever you like with it until your next fight. Have a nice day, Mr. Gonzalez. Yo, Rook, how was your first fight? I'm King K, just a Bush League scrub like you. Good meeting you, man. You look like a Sam dude. I think I can hang with you. Hey, so why don't you meet the gang, huh? This guy here is Mr. Crash. Nice to meet you, Bomb. Well, now that you've gotten to know each other, I will give you advice, Bomb. As Mr. Lino was saying, you'd better Bomb obey Mr. Grubba's conditions. If you can't clear conditions and win, your rank won't even go up. Uh, won't go up even if you win the match, Bomb. Yeah, my man has, you know, some quirky speech going on, but his advice holds up most of the time. Not just sometimes, Bomb. Advice is always useful, Bomb Bomb. Right, man, whatever. Anyway, this mean machine over here is Bandy Andy. Heh, <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm not in here too often, but if you see me around, say hi. But yeah, if you sleep in the bed over there, your HP and FP will fully recover. It's not like the cushy bed in the champ's room, though. It doesn't refill star power. Okay, cool. And this last guy with the sweet purple kicks is known as Clefter. Crack. Clefter no, like, make friend with mustache. Easy to cleft, man. He isn't the friendliest guy, but you get used to him. Anyway, that's the core minor league crew. You could need something, ask us. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. You and me are gonna have to square off eventually, so good luck, man. Love this guy. That gem of yours is insane, Double G Money. You have mad timing. I'm always looking for the best bomb bomb way to blow myself up in the ring. You see, Gonzalez, as a fighter, you can't forget to enter in the crowd bomb. Grek, no closer. <laughs> I do believe you'll go f uh, you already said that, you bitch. Oh, now I made a ba 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 Exhibition match. That's new, I think. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? Okay, then your next opponent will be... Right, Dainty in the Giz Blitz Pit, the KP Koopas. Now listen, son, this battle, I want you to wrap it up in five turns or less. I gotta do with my best gal in the few, and I don't want to be late. Now get in there and bring this puppy home quick. Hey, looks like your next match is against me. Good luck, man. To both of us. Healing is for cowards, so I will not be doing that.
Our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner. The Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Shell Machines of Doom. Yep, a fight to the finish with the KP Koopas. Come on, Mario. Come on, Mario. Let's get this over with. Me, my peeps, Gonzalez. I told you we were going to square off, and now it's on. Get yourselves ready to battle. Let's see if they're... Oh, they are different. Okay, cool, cool, cool. That's a KP Koopa. It's a Koopa Troopa with a slightly different color. Max HP is 4, attack is 2, and defense is 1. Looks like its abilities are just like any Koopa, so we ought to be a piece of cake. Don't go easy just because you know King K, Mario. That's what friends are for. What? I missed the timing. That's awkward. What the hell? Paratroopa. It's a Koopa Paratroopa of a different color. Max HP is 4, attack is 2, and defense is 1. Its attacks are the same as your average garden variety Koopa Paratroopa. So just do the same thing as always. Stomp on it, flip it, and drop its defense to 0. My head bonk is pretty effective against the 2. Come on, let's get him. Also, oh, apparently, um, I saw my friend play this, and apparently in the power jump, um, the fifth, like, jump is apparently has, like, a one frame thing, so it wasn't me messing up the timing, it just was, it does get more difficult. And I'm not gonna get that one frame considering I have, uh, quite the struggle here with the delay. Owned. I mean, good match, buddy. That's my friend. Whoops. Garso's the winner, the great Gonzalez. See, no biggie. Here's your fight money of six coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Yay. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Hey, wait, hang out a beat down out there, man. You beat me straight up. Could swing the other way next time, though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you wanna like hook up instead of like get getting getting a right hook? See the three super fine ladies out there in the front? She could talk to them, man, get some digits. Uh, sure. Do you always follow the conditions bomb set by the promoter? If you don't, your rank bomb won't go up. Crack so that is all mustache got. I guess so. Like if I talk to them, will they say something different? Or I assume he's talking about the uh three toad sisters or whatever. Don't tell me Rock Hawk is here. <laughs> everyone wants Peter to the rock. He's a tough life. Here's a little free advice trying to meet Yeah, because everyone loves to rock. Hey, you, that ain't cool. <clears throat> Don't be my fans just because you ain't got none. Lol. <laughs> K 
hear my sister's boyfriend laugh. Um... We watched Final League Max, but it really wasn't all that. Now the Major League, so... That's some hot fighting action. Damn. Damn. I must say, I find combat sport sports utterly barbarous. Oh, I need a hot steam. Are there no saunas here? If there aren't, I shall just have my hubby install one. Excuse me, installing saunas on a floating city is against the fire code? I didn't know that. You can't do it? Even for a disgusting amount of cash? Ah, you there. Tell me, sir. Do you know the whereabouts of the Glitz Pit proprietor? Why do I ask your man? Have you seen the crowds? The place is a gold mine. I want to sign a plum sponsorship deal with the wonderful vulgar place. Mommy says spit here. I think that it makes mommy like to eat. <laughs> Check. I think I got it. My headphone only works in one ear, guys. I really gotta get new headphones. I've had these for what? I think I got them to stream back in like 2017. So, seven years. I'm sucked, they're dying. Well, howdy, Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? Okay, then your next opponent will be... Rank 17, the Gliss Pit, the Pokey Triplets. Now listen, son, this battle, be sure to use a partner skill at least once. The crowd loves a tag team, and they want to see your partner show off their stuff, too. Now get in there and put your partner to work. Does her tattling count? Nice. <laughs> the arms behind the back look does look a little goofy. I'll I'll admit that. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Spike Terror Triplets. Yep, fight the finish with the Pokey Triplets. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. Go ahead, touch us. It won't hurt too much. Get yourselves ready to battle. <laughs> Okay, does this count? Yes. That's a pokey. It's a cactus school that's got nasty spines all over its body. Max HP is 4, attack is 3, and defense is 0. Look at those spines, those would totally hurt. If you stomp on it, you'll regret it. Pokies attack by lopping parts of their bodies and charging at you. They can even call friends for hopes, help, so be quick about taking them out. Can they call in help if they're, like, in a match? I feel like that- Oh, I didn't mean to jump! I didn't jump! I didn't mean to jump! Oh my god! Oh... Of course! Of course! Of course! Great. And of course I, like, wasted my freaking Um... <laughs> my- by bonus damage. <sighs> Did I put the partner swap on? I didn't. Of course I didn't. Why would I do that?
okay? Oh my god. Thank god I upgraded him. Bingo time. I'll never get it. Damn, even later than that, huh? I gotta swap out my, um, my badges. Level up. BP. Easy choice. I need more BP desperately here. All you need in life is badges, to be honest. We got ourselves a winner, the Gray Gonzalez. We won? Cool. Here to fight money for seven coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Yay! Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Hey, what's cracking, G-Man? Did you just finish beating down some poor fools or what? You're looking good, man. The old King K wouldn't mind a little bit of your luck. Yeah, that'd be nice. Get in there, you! How many times do I have to tell you? That room is absolutely off limits. If you want to remain on our fight roster, you must follow the rules. And don't think I haven't noticed you following me. Stop that too, it's creepy. You don't obey the rules, we'll ban you from the Gliss Pit, understood? Again, dude? Man, you are just a magnet for trouble. <laughs> Sorry, King K, didn't mean to bring the rules queen in here. I don't sweat to be money. Jolene can take that toot and shove it up her nose. Why are you always chasing that girl anyway, man? Oh, you know, no particular reason. Now, if you folks will pardon me, I must be off. There he go. You know a cute little toad who's working a part-time gig in the lobby? I think the lady's got a little crush on me. Every time I walk past her, she's swooning. You should always adjust your badges and partners according to your faux bomb. Do I even really need to bomb? Mention napping to heal your bomb, F HP and FP? Crack, mustache is not bad. Talk to the worker lady. Got it. I think it's her. Oh, the foot's pit! You get paid to say that, right? Her time just like him, but he's so much better than me! Ugh. I'm sorry, just thinking about it. Okay, well, that didn't tell me shit, Captain. In fact, I'm pretty sure I already read that. Let me, uh, fix my badges before I forgore. I don't need item hog on, obviously, because I won't be getting any items from these battles. Um. I still need more BP. To be honest with you. I don't remember the order of who I fight, so... We're gonna take a look. Ba -ba 
<laughs> well, boy, howdy, Gonzales. Fixing for a fight, huh? Hey, the nearest opponent will be. Rank 16 in the Glitz Pit, the Dead Bones. Now, listen, son, in this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them, their spatial moves. I think the crowd's craving a nice long battle as simple as and finest. Now, get in there and don't go with Garand's dandin. <clears throat> you got it, boss. I want more chocolatey milk. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Bone Banging Rockers. Yep, a fight to the finish with the Dead Bones. We're gonna lose the likes of you. We're gonna take the skin off your bones. Get yourselves ready to battle! Don't use special moves. Got it. <laughs> Easy. So the winner, the great Gonzalez, of course. What'd you expect, huh? We rock. True. In fact, we, we even own. Here to fight money of nine coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. Now if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Man, I heard just knock some blocks off. Not bad, Double G Man. You're the real deal, the realest I've ever seen. Keep busting heads. If anyone gives you a lip, just tell him King K said to back it up. Zow. Ever hurts. Keep quiet. My foot. Oh, you're fine. Just shut up. <laughs> Whoa, sounds like some poor sucker just earned himself a trip to the hospital. Hey man, it's a brutal sport sometimes, you know? This stuff happens. Hey, I meant to say it earlier, but we're hammer rocks, man. Think I need a weapon too? Nah, King Case Posse knows the deal. I'm all about towing the spot into the ultimate weapon. If I change it up now, my fans would just call me a sellout, you know what I mean? Teamwork is important, Bomb. The match is not just for your personal glory, Bomb. If you want to win, you need to know how Bomb and partner fights. Okay. Uh, Mustache is okay. Oh my god, I'm so tired. Guys, why am I so tired? <laughs> Every single day this week, I've been freaking woken up because Maple at 6 a.m. is like. Please. Boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fix him for a fight, huh? I'm turning my light on. Maybe any more light. Okay, then your next opponent will be rank 15 in the Gliss Pit, Spike Storm. Now, listen, son, this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them their flower points. You heard me? Let's see how you do without none of them fancy pants moves. Now, get in there and show me something, son. Who is my point? Pop on it. This is a minor league locker room. It's kind of a uh, well, it's pretty disgusting. It's totally different from the first room they showed, the old bait and switch. You think they make it totally gross so advanced fighters will try to uh, will try harder to advance? I can read. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Midnight Spike Bombers. You have a fight to finish with Spike Storm. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. Is this one I can't win against? No, I can win this. We're gonna Spike Bomb you into Smishing Punks.
No FP though, huh? I don't know how the fuck I meant to do that, but okay. I know how. Um, they covered something. These things have such high defense that you can't even hurt them when they roll up. So when they go back to normal, do all the damage you can and do it quickly. If you flip them over, their defense drops zero. That's the time to take them out. The man them is just plain stupid, so try using a power block or some other item. I have a power block. Uh, I am just gonna wait, though. <laughs> What's a Lakitu? A Lakitu? Who knows? A member of the Koopa clan that rides on clouds. Max HP is 5, attack is 2, and defense is 0, attacks by throwing spiny eggs. If you stomp on it when it's holding up a spiny egg, you'll take damage, so don't do it. Spiny eggs slowly hatch into spinies, so beat the Lakitu before fighting. Uh, aw, this was answer my real question. Where's the, where's the keep all those spiny eggs? True. Wait a minute, where does it keep all those spiny eggs? Okay, now that that's out of the way. We do another run of our Earth Tremor. I finally did it! <laughs> oh, I finally did it! Yes! I finally managed to do all the fucking steps, bro. Oh my god. I'm so proud of myself. What do you expect Tommy Rock? Does she say the same thing every time? I haven't been really paying attention to what she says. Here to fight my 10 coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Yay. Your ring went up because you met the conditions. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. Hey, man, check this. I heard the hot dogs stand outside getting a new menu item that uses a mystic egg. Do you know their hot dogs can restore your HP and FP during a match with some serious nutrition? I'm not sponsored yet. Just excited about some probably amazing hot dogs. You ought to snack on one. I think that um the color of your Yoshi depends on how much time it takes, right? I never like I always thought it was what you named it. Color of Yoshi. Thousand Year Door. I usually get the green one. Oh, okay, so it is time. But, like, since from when? What time? Um, it's just funny because, like... Um... I usually get green, and that's zero to six minutes from getting the egg. That means I fucking speedrun that shit, like, every time. 
or it takes me 20 to 26 minutes to do it. Either way. We'll just get it and like whatever color we get. I usually get the green and the black, I think. I think last time I got the red one. Let's see. Whew. I also haven't eaten today. Could do with my lack of energy, who knows? No, some of what's behavior is unacceptable in a food stuff. I insist you desist. No, please come back to me. Someone help. My rare important egg has escaped. Please help. Well, it's clearly alive, buddy. You can't cook that. Talk to him first. Petra Fulham helped us to catch it, despite its total lack of arms or legs. However, shall I make my famous spotted egg dog now? What well, was me? I ordered that incorrigible egg from the island of the south. There were associated shipping costs. Well, they'll just stand there and help me catch it. I helped. Absolutely unacceptable in a polite society. I insist you come down at once, Egg. How am I to reach you up there? Fly like a common sparrow? Yeah. Just an eepy little egg, man. Just an eepy little guy. Can't even be an eepy little guy in today's society. What are we coming to? Yeah, 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 whatever. Why am I just like so bad at the airplane thing now? I swear to God. <laughs> I'm going to go insane here. It's so adorable. What should we do? Mario, uh, help him. He's just a little guy. Well, if you're gonna say that, Mario, then I guess we should help Mr. Hot Dog Stand guy. Looks like this egg doesn't want to be eaten. It's okay to let it go, right? Oh, well, very well. Fine. I suppose there's not much market for cuisine that jumps anyway. Awesome. Did you hear that, little eggy weggy? You're free. See you around. Huh? Was it now, Eggie? You want to follow us? Is that it? I'm pretty sure our little buddy here wants to hang out with us. Do we let it? Of course we do. Hear that little guy? Just make sure not to get in our way, though, okay? He's just a little guy, man. Can I get a picture here with the egg? Damn, I missed. <sighs> I'm tired. Why am I so tired? I'm tired for the best chapter. Alright, next fight.
Um, the way things are going, I just don't feel like I've got any more. Know what I mean? Use the ammo correctly is very important too, bomb. You can buy items at the store outside the glitz pit, so take bomb a look. Don't bomb, got the coin. You can always just earn some proofs at exhibition matches. I do want money. Mustache is good. Well, boy, Harry Gonzalez fixing for a fight, huh? Okay, then your next opponent will be. Ranked 14 in the Glitz Pit, the hand it over. Now listen, son, in this battle, I want you to avoid using your hammer. Not even once, son. I want to see how you do when you ain't got something to beat a fellow with. Now get in there, and let's see some acrobatifying. Okay. Okay. Bye, little egg. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Grey Gonzalez, and the Grim Death Burglars. Yep, fights the finish with the handovers. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. Hehe. <laughs> We're awful quick, awful agile, and just plain awful. Get yourselves ready to battle. I don't know if that's how I would say it. Maybe better than uh, what I did. That's a bandit. This scumbag tries to bump you and grab coins, jerk. Max HP is 5, attack is 2, and defense is 0. If you time your guard well, when he attacks, you'll be able to steal anything. Plus, the look on bandit's face when you guard successfully is priceless. Bandit steals coins from you, defeat him before he flees to get your coins back. Um, I don't want to do loose stuff yet. Whoops. The look on my face is pretty good, to be honest. <gasps> my fresh juice! Give that back. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> I messed it up. No, my fresh juice. Damn it. A big bandit, basically a boss among ordinary bandits. HP is 8, attack is 3, and defense is 0. Like other bandits, he'll steal your items as well as your points. Totally weak. If you guard well when he charges at you, he'll blow by without stealing anything. If he robs you, you won't get your item back once you beat him right then. He'll run. Damn, bro. 8? Oh, wow. I can't! I suck at bro! Oh my god, and now she's dead. Oh dear lord. I just want the coin back from the bandit.
recipes, Kumbella. That's my bad. Gotta have a winner, the great Gonzalez. What do you expect, huh? We rock. <laughs> Here to find me ten coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Your latest G Man? My boy said they saw a stunning babe have a, ju a juice of the fresh juice shop. She likes juice, I like juice. We already have so much in common. Check her out for me, man. I already talked to her once, though. My little egg guy. Come on, we're going outside. <laughs> hey there, Gonzalez. How's it going? <laughs> Me, I'm doing a little research. <laughs> hey, speaking of which, ever hear of the Seven, one, seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? <laughs> yes, this place has rumors and secrets and spades, but... The Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit are the most mysterious of the bunch. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Well, so how about I want to hear whether the Seven Wonders or not? They say there's a sealed wall in the minor league locker room. Some say the remains of fallen athletes were stored there. Anything else you want to hear about? They say in one of the arena's bathrooms, a man eating toilet lurks. Some say Anyone who sees this toilet never sees anything again. They say... There's a room in the glitz pit with a second floor, but no stairs. They say no one has ever gone up the stairs, and some say that groaning voices sometimes come from the second floor. They say that the champion's room is haunted. Some say if you keep still in the room, you'll hear voices whispering from nowhere. Some even say the voices are athletes who lost the champion. My friend's friend's friend told me this one. He said he saw a strange light leaking under the ring doors when no one was there. I couldn't see inside the door since the doors were locked. I plan to investigate this myself. He's gonna die. They say, sometimes fighters disappear for no reason, never to return. Some say, the very first champion, Prince Musk, was speared away in this way. Grub is a strange one. His body is incredibly toned, even though he's past 60. He must have an exceptional training regimen. Then there's the matter of Ms. Jolene. They say, she suddenly vanishes at times. Some say a fighter saw her go in the bathroom and waited for her to come out. But she never did. Huh? You think it's strange that someone staked out of her bathroom? Yeah. Just a little bit. You know, it's possible that Seven Wonders are just gossiping rumors. But I've got to tell you, I think they're real and I think they're sketchy. I smell a rat behind all this and someday I'll solve all these mysteries. Hey, if you ever want to hear more about this stuff, just say the word, okay? Mush Prince, the first Glitz Pit champion, the fighter long since lost. He's shown truly and brightly. Many fans still hope that he may dramatically return. Of course, I'm one of them. I long to see the poetry of his pure fighting style. Wow, great talk.
So glad I came all the way out here for that. All right, little guy. Watch me own this next one. My boy Howdy Gonzalez, fixed him for a fight, huh? Okay, then your next opponent will be rank 13 the Glitz Pit, the Mind Bogglers. Now listen, son, this battle, I want you to avoid swapping partners out. Gotta go with who brung you. A fight's the end, side by side, now that's drama. Now get in there and stand by your part. I hadn't done that so I wanted to. I'm biting my lips like crazy. What's wrong with me? This is my disgusting tasting chapstick. Damn, if I had known it was gonna be these guys, I would have probably used coops maybe. The grain tanglers, yep, fights the finish with the mind bogglers. We aren't gonna lose the likes of you. Try to be ensnared, mystified, and devoured. Yeah, okay, buddy. One game away from gold. Wow. Um. Pressed it too many times. That's okay. We got ourselves a winner, Le Grey Gonzalez. See, no biggie. She's such a shit talker. I love her. I made back all the money I spent to get that ticket. Let's go. Listen, man, keep in your hat, but thinking about retiring soon. Stay any longer, will you? My future might get shorter, you know? So after the next match, I'm gone. It ain't cool to quit and run, that's for sure, but you know what? That's life, Double G, man. Listen, you stay cool, okay? Promise me you won't forget you once knew King K. I'll marry you for the rest of my life, actually. It all always stinks that we won't be hanging out together anymore, but hey, that's life, you know, G-Man? Even if you're not feeling your best, you must put on a bomb bomb good show. Sorry we're not into it, but that's what being a bomb pro is about. Crack mustache got game. I'm sorry, little guy! Oh my god, I just hammered him like an asshole. Oh boy, hey, I have a face for right, blah blah. And then the point will be Rank 12 in the Glitz Pit, the Punk Rocks. Now listen, son, this battle, I want you to voice any of them their spatial moves. I think the crowd's craving a nice long battle that is simplest and finest. Now get in there and go, don't go grandstand and good because I am out of uh, special power. Look at the egg jumps when I leave, like he's cheering me on. Da, 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 da. 
For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Green Torture Squad. Yep, fight the finish with the Punk Rocks! We aren't gonna lose to the likes of you. This don't take long. Descendant paint for a mustache. That's a hyper ball clef, like clefs and ball clefs. This is also a rock monster. Max HP is 3 attack, is 2 defense is 2. This hyper version can build up its energy, boosting its attack to 8 on the next turn. It is low HP, but its body is rock hard and pervious to fire, making it super tough. To see that item attacks are pretty effective, beat it before it goes hyper. I don't have items. Um, I actually need to go buy items for this, this one. Um, whoops. Wait, I think they're vulnerable when you flip them over. Okay. I should use Earth. Wait, I have Quake Hammer. What am I talking about? I literally left Quake Hammer on this exact reason. I'm stupid. Alright, relax. Okay, well, that, that works too, I guess. Gotta sell the winner, the Gray Gonzalez. See, no biggie. You said the last time. We're using phrases, SMH. Damn, he's gone. Developing a, a reliable style is good, but don't forget to try new things, Bomb. That's the way you make new discoveries and really grow as a bomb fighter. Grack, cut your cat, think of criticism for mustache. Um, okay, I think this is the one where I give up. Bro, I'm not stream until I finish the chapter. I have like another three hours of stream. Oh boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? Okay, then your opponent will be. Ranked 11 in the Glitz Pit. The bomb, -op, the bomb -op spot. Now, this battle, I want you to avoid using your jump, so no jump whatsoever. I want to see a pure test of power without none of that flouncing around, you get me? Now get in there and hand out a whooping or two. Easy clap. I think you also have to wait less time for um, the to show up. <laughs> what? What? What did I say? I have ADHD. I already forgot what I said. Show up. Time. I don't know what I said. What are you talking about? More time to show up? Huh? I don't know. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Big Bomb Boomers. Yep, fights the finish with the Bomb Bomb Squad. I do the Memory of Goldfish, this is true. I can confirm that that is the case. <laughs> My bad for having ADHD. I guess I'll just I'll just, just end my end it all then, I suppose. Good luck on your gold quest, King. It's a bob bomb. Can't have spy blowing yourself up, yeah, real smart. And my HP is 4 attack, is 2 defense is 1. Bob Bomb will fully get mad if you damage it. They have like super short fuses. If it gets mad, it'll charge and explode on its next turn. That attack really hurts. Oh, and if it's mad, it'll blow up in the slightest contact, so don't attack directly. Attack it from a step away with a hammer or hit it with something hard, like a shell.
I gotta do it all in one go, basically. Fuck you. Why? Twitter, the Gray Gonzalez. Be fun? Cool. Yeah, okay, buddy. That's why I hate playing with this freaking guy. Nah, I love Koops. I'm just kidding. I don't know why I'm being so mean to him lately. It's quite lonely without King K around Bomb. No lonely, him too weak, now him not here. Sound normal to Klepter. You are in bomb denial, Klepter. I saw you weeping in the in the, the something. Well here we are. This is your locker room. You're starting the minor league, of course. If you just now started your career. If you don't like this dingy room, I suggest you work your way up for the ranks. When you're afraid to fight, just log on this computer terminal here. Mr. Garbo will then decide who you'll match up against. You will have no say in this. Why don't you try it once? Walk up to the screen, log on with A. Then quick rank man. Quick. 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 <sighs> I don't know. This is like, like blah, 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 blah. I saw stuff he said to me. Get ready. Your wings dirty. Piece of cake. Fired. Move. Triple flip in me. Triple flip in me out. Why can't I get rules like that? What the hell? He doesn't want me to triple flip in Meow. That's crazy. <laughs> this fact just started to do a triple flip Meow. Pretty easy. Yeah. I do it all the time, you know? Sir Swoop. Um, hi guys. Yeah, my name's Swoop. Sir Swoop. I mean, nice to meet you. Oh. Okay, security's here to escort you to the ring. I don't think get completely destroyed out there. Um, actually... Um, let's go. I think I'm ranking up after this one, right? Well, dog my cat. If it ain't the Grey Gonzalez, fix him for a fight, huh? <laughs> Hooey, you're gonna love this. Your next opponent is... Rank 10, the Gliz Piss, Pit, the Iron Adonis Twins. That's right, you're darn too, and you're finally making a go without a major league, son. You're chasing great things from you, so don't go letting us down now. Now listen, son, this battle. Be sure to use, le use a partner skill at least once. The crowd loves a tag team, and they want to see your partner show their stuff too. Now get in there and put your partner to work. Wait, why won't he say anything? Teamwork's important, Bomb. No, the match is not just for your personal glory, Bomb. If you want to win, you need to know how Bomb, your partner, fights. I think you said that already. Grack, left her with Mustache is strong. Wait, I need, uh, Goombella out. Whatever, I have quick stop, doesn't matter. Don't matter at all, I got quick swap. And now, today's main event, the Major League awaits 11th ranked Gray Gonzalez. But only if he can be the 10th ranked powerhouse is the Iron Adonis Twins. First, let's get the merciless execution in here, folks, the Gray Gonzalez. Gonzalez, get on our tails, look at loose, loves that mustache. It is a pretty good mustache. <laughs> Hooey! The Greg Gonzalez, how you feeling? Just perfect. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, now you heard the fellow folks. It's the obsession to mix it up some. Good 
Good gravy. Whoa, we're space legal. <laughs> the challenge was real confident, boys. Yep, he's talking trash. Larry and Adonis twins, he said, more like paper dog face bros, and they stink. And then he said, I bet they just play video games and cry when they lose. Um, yeah, and, and then he said, Rowdy belly buttons run their family, stink wads. And so on, yep. What? How's you know mom has an Audi, that jerk? We're gonna blend you up in a smoothie, pal, and then we're gonna drink ya. Oh, one more thing. Only smelly stink stinkwads call each other stinkwads. Understand, stinkwad? Simmer down there, bro. You, you stinkwad, you're gonna regret opening your yap, pal. See these bods? Solid iron. See the spikes? Yeah, they penetrate any substance. So basically, what I'm telling you is that whatever you try will be completely useless. Think that over in the very short time you have left with a functional brain. So we're gonna give you a concussion, maybe a lobotomy. Wow, we will watch be in the major league. Let's show our stuff. <laughs> Give up now. We'll stink watch for to learn about our skills the hard way. Um That's an iron cleft. That guy is scary, period. Nice HP is 6, attack is 4, and defense is unknown? What's with this book? It says no attack will work against iron clefts. There's nothing in the world as hard as an iron cleft, and so its defense is impenetrable. That's true. The only way to beat one is to whack it with the other one. In a way, it may not be a bad idea at this point. Well, I want to get the um, paddle on the other guy, so we can wait. Plus, I need to get, um, more star points, power, whatever. That's an iron cleft. The green shoes mean this one must be the younger brother. Max HP is 6, attacks 4, and defense is unknown. What's with this book? It says blah 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 blah. It's saying all this hard line. I don't know if I don't know. It's Might as well appeal. Get owned, idiot. Okay, well. Cool. Now we run away. Got ourselves a winner, the Iron Adonis Twins! <laughs> like that, we try to tell you, but no. If you want another piece of pummel pie, have a bath and come on back, punk. Pummel pie, huh? Here to find money, one coin, Mr. Gonzalez. Not even minimum wage. Fuck you. Hey, check it out, our little eggy friend is gone. Didn't see that coming, or going for that matter. Where do you think it went? Yo! Blue, yeah! He's so cute! Gonzalez, check me out. Thanks to you, I had to save a sound. Thanks, man. What? You were in that cute little eggy weggy? Whoa, that's wild. Yep, yeah, who cares? You guys want to be champs, right? You want the crystal star? Anyway, I gotta repay you for saving me from old Hoggle out there, so I'll fight for you. I just realized that's a pig selling hot dogs. I just realized that. I call my own. I, I'll swallow any opponent, hold on, it's just leave it to me. Huh, my name? Let's see, I just came out of the egg, so I guess I don't have a name yet. You seem fired up about it, so why don't you give me one? Make it cool, okay? Uh, what's the cool name, guys? What's the cool name? 
Um, what's the cool name? Um, um, I know, uh, Mark. That's a cool name. Hmm, Mark, huh? Not too bad, dude. Not too bad at all. Yeah, I like it. Okay, Gonzalo, let's get out there and do some damage. Yoshi's not your friend. He'll answer to Mark. Cool. Hi, guys. This is my Yoshi friend, Mark. <laughs> Press X to ride Yoshi. Okay. You move much faster while riding Yoshi. Try moving around with L. While jumping, hold A to flow through the air for a brief time. Just really the oh, they changed it to A? That's nice. It used to be, I think, X. But it was so unintuitive because your usual jump is A. Or maybe I'm insane. Uh, in battle, you can repeatedly bounce on enemies using his ground pad move or use gulp to inhale enemies whole and spit them out for massive damage. He's the best partner. I mean, it's a hard, that's a hard choice actually to say who's the best partner. Whew. Those hot dogs outside are amazing. You can even eat one during a match to store both your HP and FP. Here is the important bomb. The match is not just for your personal glory bomb. Blah, 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 you guys said that punk. Crack, crack your mustache is strong. All right, let's heal up a little bit. This is our last time sleeping in this dingy ass room, so. Hmm. So we are moving up in the world. By the way, my tag team again wear partner. Epic. Guys, it's Jover for these guys. <laughs> you think you could take me and Gonzalez? Ha! These old are hard buzz, just can't lose. This, this is the most sus chapter as well, I suppose. Let me at him. We're gonna take these punks this time. Stink was challenging us again. He never learns. Looks like he brought some new shrimpy partner. I said that's gonna help him. These <laughs> little Yoshi noises are so much I, I can actually hear them. Yo, she just make me rain low. That really hurt. Ah, uh, but his pointy nest is being used against us, no fair. Dang, bro, he has he discovered our weak points. I'll just sit here looking pretty. I, I don't know why I, I can super grab the first one, but not the second one. That's so funny. Star points. Yahoo! Ooh. Do we do a bit of minor league now, bro? I think I'm gonna be sick. Congratulations, uh, Craig Gonzalez. With this win, you made the major league. Now with that, folks, it was what I call a wild and wooly fight. A diggity dang doozy. Keep it up, kid. You're going places I can tell. Hoo wee! Come down now, folks. Give it up. We got a new major leaguer. Let's hear it for him. Woohoo! 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 
Get your fight money of 14 corns. Corns? Um. And Mr. Gonzalez. Mr. Grover wishes to see you in his office. Follow me. Mr. Grubba, I brought Mr. Gonzalez as you requested. M -m -m Mr. Lean, you mind our manners now. We knock around here, Missy. I apologize, Mr. Grubba. Don't you worry your pretty little head about none. Now, what I want again? Something about Gonzalez. Oh, yeah! Gonzalez, you old so and so. Let me congratulate you, son. Major League already, huh? I had a feeling you're going places, and dang, I love it when I'm right. You just keep putting on, you just keep putting tushes in them seats. I'm counting on you, son. I got a special little something, something for you. Go on, take it. Wow, thirty coins. So yeah, something else is in my mind. Your costume ain't cool. No big deal, son. But hey, someday if you become a champ, I'll get you a new one. Something hot, paint me with frills or something. You look, look, you look a sight, son. Anyway, that's something for another day, pard. Take a powder, okay? Mr. Gonzalez, please follow me if you would. Now the real story begins. This is the Major League locker room. He'll use this room from the moment on. I don't know why she's got an accent now. The match system is just is the same as the minor league, but the bouts are harder. Try not to get comp completely destroyed out there, okay, Mr. Gonzalez? Well, if you'll excuse me, I must be going now. Pink Game Boy. I had both. I think the blue one was mine and the green the pink one was my sister's, because I liked blue and Sierra liked pink at the time. We switched. What's the deal with Achilles, guys? Show a little friendliness? Sheesh. Oh, there he is, Mr. Rockhawk. Still, the guy coming through. Listen up, losers. I've been hearing about some rising star tearing up the league. It's you, isn't it? Yeah, you fit the bill. Skinny, a mustache named Gonzalez. Man, I came all over here to, for you. <laughs> what a waste of time. Oh my god, relax. What's your deal, Gonzalez, huh? Oh, the champs belt. One well, that. Hey, you get too close to the hawk, you might get rocked. I'm not sure, but it definitely looks weird. I think you're right, Gonzalez. Fake. Hmm. Hey, you think you just smack talk the rock hawk like that? I don't think so. You got some guts calling my belt a fake, you shrimpy no belt having wimps. Did your mama teach you just any manners? Whoa, sorry, y'all, dude. I didn't mean to strip on your big bad belt. Does that make you fun of me, punk? You're only your life only because we ain't in the ring right now. If I see you in those lights, I'll take you apart. Remember the rock. <laughs> wow, I really push that dude's buttons, huh? A little bit. Well, forget him. We got a problem. You're not pointing at Glissville, right? But that dude's belt has a fake crystal star on it. Then where the heck is the real one at? <laughs> oh, is that your mailbox SP going off? Who'd you get an email from? If you want the crystal star, heed my instructions from X. Who the heck is this X dude? Talks like he's the man to see about the crystal star. Why would we want to help us out, though? This whole deal seems kind of whack. Gonzalez, even if the belt's a fake, I think we should try to take the championship anyway. It's the best way to find out what's really going on here in the Gliss Pit. Truing? Now we got the cool spooky music. Bow. Bow. Nice. Nice. I'm just stealing these people's stuff, too. 
Occupied. Hey, what are you the hammer? You're buying my style. I'm the hammer guy. Okay. I'll be the champ someday, you bet. Uh-huh, that's right. Just like the big legendary champion, Prince Mush. Destroy the foe before you. That is the only concern of a true warrior. You're pretty tough, baby, but you're gonna have you're gonna really have to power up to win here. Let's reserve a match. Bo had a Gonzalez fixing for a fight, huh? Okay, then your next opponent will be rank nine, the Glitz Pit, the tiny spines. Now listen, son, in this battle I want you to use at least one special move, okay? The crowd needs something flashy. You catch my drift, give him a good show. Get in there and blow off the roof, son. Okay, let's change back to Miss Gumbella. Should I go out and like upgrade my? Uh... I think I have three shine sprites. Yeah. I think I might go and upgrade um our little guy here. Thorny demons, yep, fight to finish with the tiny spinies. Let's get this over with, I agree. He's gonna be fun poking fun at you. Thank god. Bam bam bam. The red spike top. It's the most well protected of the buzzy but beetle species. Attack is SHP is five, attack is three, and defense is a whopping four. Yep, this guy is hard. Is this chapter always so suspicious? So sussy? Was it always this sussy? Like, was it always this sussy? I, I feel like there's just been a lot of really weird, suspicious moments happening here. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. Alright, maybe the problem is me. I don't know. There's a really high defense and fire and explosions don't hurt it at all. You can just find a way to flip it over. It's underside has a defense of zero, and that spike, what a pain. There's gotta be a way to flip it over. There sure is. It's called having a spike shield. But we have to use this, so it doesn't matter. I, I did not even react fast enough for that at all. That's my bad. Damn. Uh, that's fine. Oh yeah, totally needed to do this. Thank gosh you got me the extra damage for these guys. So the winner, the Gray Gonzalez. Would you expect Tom? We rock, just like the Hawk. Here's your fight money of fifty coins, Mister Gonzalez. You're going up because you met the conditions. Yeah, 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 yeah. She's just always busy. I love like the paper crafting style. Um, like the bench, like anything that has like the folded stuff, like with like the little tiny openings, because it's not like perfect. I love that. I forget who my next opponent is. 
don't remember anyone, actually. Well, had a boy. How, how, well, boy had a Gonzalez fixing for a fight, huh? Okay, then your opponent will be ranked A in the Gliss Pit, the Poker Faces. Nelson, this battle, I want you to keep that part of yours from doing any damage. You hear me? Keep that little fire brand on chick. Got it? You, only you, Tag. Uh, does that count if I use my my skill? I need to use that. <laughs> Damn, this is gonna be a little difficult then because. Um, it's the ones where you can't get close to them, or they'll eat you. I have, I have a camera on, so it should be okay. <sighs> Our next battle, we got the Merciless Ice Cream, okay? The ultimate weapons! Yep, a fights the fans with the poker faces. Alright, let's get this over with. Ooh, you gave me coleslaw, kid, and that ain't good. True, coleslaw is gross. They are right. Don't ever let your partner damage the opponent. Okay. That's a bristol toy covered in spikes. They're so prickly. Axe HP is 2, attack is 1, defense is 4, and they're impervious to fire. Even when trying to get close enough to back with the hammer, hammer, hammer? Wow. Hammer's dangerous. Seriously, the spikes will totally pop out. So, since you can't jump under your hammer, you better use an item. Says you. Easy. I think I'll probably upgrade my my badge points again. Tempted to do FP though. Easy. See, no biggie. Truing. Bye, bunny. I'm making bank, yeah. Whoa, Mario, that's another email, right? Don't just stand there, check it. What if I don't want to? Go to the watering hole outside the glitz pit. So that X guy again, great. The watering hole, huh? If you say so, X. Who is this mystery guy? Yeah, still an SP. Um Fire Emblem kid still likes Fire Emblem for the Game Boy and the the mon the monitors and the rooms are still Game Boy advances. You know? They didn't change any of that. I mean, what else will they change it to like a like a like a 3DS or something or a DS maybe? It's just that the the Game Boy SP looks like a phone. You know? It makes sense. <laughs> oh, hey, Mr. Gonzalez. Yeah, that's the message I've been waiting for. Actually, you're pretty late. Someone left a package and a note by the door a bit ago. It said, look for a thick stashed man named Gonzalez and give him this. And this is this. It's a random fucking super hammer. No, Mario's got the, uh... Mario get iPhone? No, Mario has the Android flip thingy. <laughs> hey, it's me again! Toadette! So nice to see you again, Mario! I'm glad you just gave us super hate for now! Hope it get cool now, get me! Let's get to practicing it! It's a little hard, but I'm sure you'll get it! Hold on me and rotate out until your body... I cannot do the toad voice today, guys. Speed reformer, super hammer tip. He is your only up for releasing me. That 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 B, you did not get picked up on the microphone at all. That's awesome. Guys, one day I'm gonna learn how to do a pitch that breaks glass. I can't reach high pitches, but I'm gonna try. Yep. Okay, great! You mentioned the super hammer! 
she blushed. She was blushing. With a super hammer move, you can even break big blocks like this! Oh, gee, I almost forgot! Super hammer, ultra hammer, ten pounds, moves it down too! <laughs> so, as far as I can tell, the hammer is the new model. They have Ram Whack 2005. Real nice hammer all around. Solid craftsmanship, good grip, high bonk ability. The commercials for this thing say that the hammer chooses its user. The RGB there, so whoever gave this to you must be a big fan. But why leave it in this juice shop? Isn't that odd? I mean, it's not that hard to hand a gift to a pro fighter. Mario, another email? Smash the blockade in the locker room from X. Lock in the locker room, huh? What's behind something? Why does only this one part have like a hole in it? Still can't get over that gift. You know, you could the time we started getting mailed hammers. Why can't I purchase any juice? It's not fair. Hot dogs suck. What the hell? <laughs> Only five HP and five FP? That's nothing. To be completely honest with you. I have got saved <laughs> in like who knows how long. Not that it really matters with the switch because you'll worry about the power going off, which is very nice. Oh look, it's a me, Mario! That's bad, that's a bad Mario impression, guys. Sorry. Sorry to hear that. I know you've come to expect better Mario impressions from me at this point. I let you all down. I'm really glad you can jump over a lot of things now. I feel like, like, they managed to take the original playthrough of the game and, like, do, like, testing with it. You know what I mean? Like, they were like, oh, look, thousands of millions of people have played this. We can use this as, like, free playtesting, basically. Hey, Gonzalez, how's it going? Well, so how about I want to hear about the Seven Wonders? No, you already told me about all of them, buddy. But isn't it locked? Start telling me you have no idea who got inside. What do we pay you for? <laughs> oh, sorry, Miss Jolene. I heard a noise in there, but I couldn't find nothing. Hmm. Fine. Leave the rest of this matter to me. Go back to your post. And listen to me carefully. Do not ever tell anyone of this or I'll have your job. You, Mr. Gonzalez, this is highly inappropriate. What business do you have here? Please, I must ask you to stay out of this place, out of places where you have no business being. I'm just walking the halls, ma'am. How can I open this? I forget. <laughs> Why do they even like pose like that when I talk to them? That's so bizarre. X was the way to get the key. That's rough, buddy, but I'm out here winning all my battles, so get good, I suppose. Masterization privileges are for the great Gonzales are currently suspended. What's the story here? Is this X's doing? Oh, I actually have never tried to battle 
during this. So that's interesting. Where the fuck do I get the key from? I like forget. Uh, I really do not remember at all. Thanks. Thanks, Kujok. Elf Tars. Incredible. Where the hell did I get the key from? I forgot. I'm trying to remember. I literally do not remember at all, actually. Holding up. Where the fuck did I get the key from? I like. I'm pressing A, am I not? Oh wait, the locker room. I'm stupid? Duh. Ah, oh, Gazelles, isn't it? I go where that you somehow fell back down to the minor league again. Can't say I understand why. Anyway, go on in. Starting on minor league? Is that a thing that happens? Mm. No, Goombella. What? What? What letter did we just receive, you idiot? Hey, it's just Stingball. What are you doing here? You want to fight us at the ring? I'll give you a fight, you big jerk. Mr. Gonzalez, you're back in the minor league. What's the matter, Bomb? Did you leave something in here, Bomb? Grack, is supposed to shoot to left at Clifter. Grack. No, I'm here to destroy this wall. Now you guys have a whole extra room. Isn't that cute? And you have like a broken computer, but you could probably get it to work if you tried. And you got books to read. That's fun. Just so you guys know, I am awful at this. So, um... Set documents that go into detail about a lot of important stuff. Whoa, Gonzalo, this is some kind of scientific paper on the crystal stars. Who would be investigating those things besides us? They even took pictures. I felt it was fake, but the real star has got to be here somewhere. Who would something like this lying around that just reeks of funny business? You again, Mr. Gonzalez, what are you doing in here? This is the minor league locker room. Major league athletes are forbidden. Even if they weren't, it's hardly appropriate to bash down our walls. Hmm. I'll be confiscating this, thank you very much. Sussy. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Maple's so silly. 
Dang, what's with her? We busted our home scanning information. Yeah, whatever. Some people just gotta rain on parades. Well, at least you know the crystal star's here. Okay, bye, bitches. See you later. See you later, losers. All right, back to battling. Okay. Well, boy, had Gonzalez fishing for a fight, huh? Okay, the next opponent will be. Rank seven, the Gliss Pit, the Shell Shockers. Now listen, son, this battle, I want you to voice swapping partners out. Yeah, go with who brung you. Fight to the end, side by side. Now that's drama. Now get in there and stand by your part. Okay, well, I need Goombala out then. I simply must tattle on every single creature. <laughs> I'm thirsty. So did they also cut out the animation walking um, from our room to here? I like forget if that was normal for every battle or not. For our next battle, we got the merciless executioner, the great Gonzalez, and the turtles of hurdle. Yep, a fight to the finish with the shell shockers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So called great Gonzalez, don't think I'm gonna take it easy on you, baby. Yippee! Damn, bitch. Ow. That's a shady Koopa. It's yet another member of the Koopa family tree. Ice HP is 8, attack is 3, and defense is 1. The difference between them and other Koopas? They can attack from their backs. Oh shit, these are those guys? That's not all. While their backs, their attack gets boosted, and they use a terrifying technique. Oh, that's pretty tricky. No wonder they're called Shady Koopas, huh? They thought they- I thought, I thought they spin when they're able to do that. Oops. That's awkward. Six HP is crazy. Six HP is absolutely insane, actually. That's a Shady Paratroopa. It's a Shady Koopa with wings, obviously. Hey, max HP is 8, attack is 3, and defense is 1. Aqua swing off and a shady Koopa. Unlike typical Koopas and Paratroopas, the attack jumps when it flips off on its back. This also says it has a move that hits you and your partner at once. Is that possible? Uh, I guess the best thing to do is beat it quickly after we flip it. Jesus Christ. Okay. Let's fucking get their asses while we can, yeah? Hammer, I might be able to actually kill it. I don't know why I thought it wouldn't. I'm not sure why I'm not hitting those anymore. Yay! What do you expect, Tom? We rock. Uh, Gonzalez? Who's that? Oh, it's the other guys. Oh, shit, that's right. These guys come over. 
Whoa, Nelly, don't be my ass, folks. The Iron Donna's twins are in a rage. You missed like suckers the other day, now you're gonna pay for it. Oh, let's hide from Ranch Grey Stink. Watch you better prepare for pain. Hey. Oh my gosh, are you gonna win? If you fail this fight here, I'll lose you forever. <laughs> Real. Why don't you just run away? You know. You can do that? Yeah, to end the fight quicker. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, so that we don't have to waste time before you get Yoshi. I already have Yoshi. Well, yeah, I saw when you said 12 partner. Yeah, I know oh. that this is the part where he come back to fight me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. yeah. You could also just run away now and it's like fine. Matter. Same thing with the Bowser fight, you just totally skip it, okay? I've never done that, I might do that, this sounds That's funny. That sounds funny as fuck. That's really funny. I would have said no. I don't feel like finding you guys, actually. Fuck you. We lost after all that. We reek. <laughs> Who -wee! has our great Gonzalez friends and neighbors? Kid ain't. Don't even blink when the Iron Doss twins barge in an attack. Woo. Tough. He's too dang tough. Yeah, his kids are only. is only bound for bigger things, folks. Until next time, everyone. See ya. I'm lit. I'm Mario is definitely middle aged. Am I wrong? Is Mario, like, canonically younger? Is Mario, like, canonically, like, 20 or something? I don't know. I'm, like, thinking about it. I really don't know. <laughs> Gonzalez, another email? What now? Keep sticking your nose where it don't belong and you are dead meat. Man, that dude sounds peeved. I'm thinking that isn't our ex buddy. What do you- who do you think would send someone like that? I don't know, some freak probably. Someone whose name rhymes with- never mind. Never mind. A boy had a Gonzalez fixed for revive, blah blah blah. The fuzz. Damn pat, okay? Do not do any damage at all. The crowd loves your partner, so let them do fighting instead. Give them what give the people what they want. Now get in there and share that spotlight. Okay. Let me get uh Bella out as always. Hopefully I remember what the timing is for the fuzzies to block them. We will see. <laughs> for our next battle, we got the merciless execution of the great Gonzalez and the bottomless vacuums. Yep, a fight to the finish with the fuzz. <laughs> Imagine wrestling on a wooden floor. Ouch. Ow, owie. That's a green fuzzy. As you can see, it's a fuzzy. And it's green. Duh. Max HP is 5, attack is 3, and defense is 0. This is similar to normal fuzzy, so it replenishes HP as it sucks it out ours. Ew. This is, that's just the grossest thing ever. No one find that idea gross? Seriously, there's something wrong with you. The main difference between this and the other fuzzies is that this one multiplies. You know, I bet this thing would look great sitting next to a gold, fu gold fuzzy.
<laughs> nope. I forgot it. You mother fricker. Flower fuzzy. Wow, what a totally pretty fuzzy, don't you think? I have HP is 6, attack is 3, and defense is 0. Let's sing attacks by boinging in and sucking out FP. How uncool. We need FP. Let's charge up its own FP and use magical attacks. Better beat it before it does. Oh, I just got it. The flower fuzzy because it sucks out your FP, flower points. Duh. Yeah, no shit. Please stop multiplying. I wonder if I can do the super one. I want to try it. for me to do that, I think. I don't know what the timing is. Wait, I did the wrong thing! Oh, I did that so poorly, too! Jesus fucking Christ. Mary. 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 Oh my god, Mary! What is wrong with you? Oh my god, if I lose this fight because I, I'm stupid, I'll cry. Like, he's gonna die. He's literally gonna die. I don't know what the timing is for that, so I really can't do much. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, Mark, it's all up to you. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. I don't even have like enough like FP stuff. Oh my god, I'm gonna get owned here. God. I really should consider going to upgrade Yoshi. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> this, this is a terrible battle that's happening right now. God. <laughs> oh 
my god. <laughs> what happened with this battle? At least I'll level up. Oh my lord. I'm never getting out of here. This is the longest battle for no reason other than like the mistake I made that has cost me everything. I can't even remember what that mistake was anymore. Oh my god. Do I even have anything that can like... Fuck you. It's sweet tea time, guys. in progress. I am making mega bank on this one here. Okay, what is the sun after the star? And the star is after the flower? My brain's not going fast enough to fucking do that. <laughs> I had leveled up my guy. It's -a me, Mario. Hello, everybody. You can see that you like the 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 B is like way shorter than it's like a frame compared to the A, which is like really long. That's why it's so easier, much easier to do. I think we're gonna do a stylish move for that. Jeez, Lil B is man. It didn't have to be like that. Maybe I should upgrade my FP. If that showed me anything. more BP though to be honest with you. And all you got? Yeah, you tell them. I'm gonna go upgrade Yoshi. <laughs> Yay. Hey you, Gonzalez. Julian brought you a piece of cake from a fan, I guess. I think this one's good, right? Right? You get two cakes and one's good, one's bad, correct? Thanks, I really needed that. <laughs> really needed to recover my HP and FP there. I'm gonna go level up Yoshi. I need him for like at least two more of the fights, so. Flip down, 
out of here. Owie. I need a snack, guys. I'm hungry. I gotta, I gotta order more protein shakes or bars or something. I ain't got no snacks. I'm gonna order protein bars right now. So I don't forgore. I want to get the same bars that I got, um, protein bays. I also want a protein bay. <laughs> Ooh, the Power Crunch, uh, triple chocolate's in stock, though. Power Crunch goes crazy, guys. Like, that shit is tasty. Damn. Maybe I'll get those. Um, I just love wafers. Do I want strawberry cream, uh, chop mint chocolate, red velvet, chocolate chocolate chip cheesecake? What the fuck? I've never heard that. I'd have what? I've never gotten this flavor. I'm gonna get this one. The fuck chocolate chip cheesecake is crazy. Okay, we do it. That reminds me, I need to tell my mom that we have like fish flavored stuff for maple as well. I just love eating protein bars, guys. Look at the, I just noticed that the uh, like, like, like posts are rusted, that's awesome. It's a cute little detail. I got this big hammer now. I could go down here. I also never went this way, I realized. I have ADHD. God, I had the fucking like instant kill on still because that could have ended terribly. Oh my gosh. Why would you even need to break that bot that block? If you can already just go through here by using this. Did I ever blow this off? I didn't. You 
think it's just the boat panel at the end here that I can't do yet. Oh. Lame. I mean, I guess over here we just break the uh, box that's here while we're here. Might as well. Okay. Cute. And we can break this one here since we're here. Maybe this area had shine stars before and I forgot about it. That would make sense. I love how poorly to get put together the pipes are. It's really funny. I would like to upgrade my partner, please. Just Mark. Mark is the homie, you know? Shazibi! Shazubi! <laughs> Stretching always feels so good, guys. Nope. Not that I can, but... Alright, back we go. Now that little homie is, uh, ready to fucking own. Actually, I need to fucking get more items because I just absolutely de decimated my entire everything. Like, good lord, man. <laughs> Took the gradual sewer by accident. Why did I do that? I meant to grab something else. Or maybe I got that from somewhere. Just kidding. Maybe I'm just stupid. Look, my mystic egg, thank you. Just hold the egg is so funny. Like, just holding it. I need more FP recovering items. I don't really need, um... To be honest, I don't really need the, the HP stuff. I need more FP stuff. Why not? I'm gonna go buy a life stream too, just in case. That's what I would say if I was a coward. <laughs> I 
I'm just gonna store my last mushroom. I don't really want to hold it. And my gradual syrup. Uh, don't want to withdraw anything else. Hmm. I'll just take this and make another FP item. I think that's it. Sorry. ma'am. Okay. I literally used like all the items I had on that one fuzzy battle. That's really depressing actually. <laughs> I just realized I could walk faster now because I have Yoshi. I could be saving so much time. <laughs> Yay. I love like looking back on like me trying to solve so many puzzles as a, as a kid and just like it just it was just not in ways that my brain could think of like solving puzzles especially in like the twilight town area or the part afterwards whatever the area is called the forbidden, forbidden forest i don't know Spooky, spooky swords. faster I go now. Alright, little buddy, let's go. Uh, let us rank, reserve a match. Yep, fixing for a fight. Magic masters. Avoid using any items. Empty the pockets. Real men don't need trinkets. Okay. No problem. My guy. For next battle, we got the merciless execution of Gigan Dolls and the underworld servants. Yep, a fight to the finish with the magic of masters. <laughs> Seriously, let's get it over with. I agree. You out to fear our dark magic. Yeah, okay, buddy. That's a red magic Koopa. It's a Koopa wizard dressed in red. Max to be a 7, attack is 4, and defense is 0. Besides using offensive magic, you can also use magic to boost attack and defense. When it's alone, this wizard will use magic to multiply. The fact that you can't tell which is the real one after it multiplies is super annoying. I have to say though, that shade of red is definitely not its color. Damn. Oh, 
Ok. Interesting. That's a white magic Koopa. It's a Koopa wizard dressed in white. Max HP is 7, attack is 4, and defense is 0. Hey, tackle with magic and can replenish its alley's HP. You better hit it first, huh? Oh, it also says it'll use magic to make copies of itself when it's all alone. Which is totally annoying, because then you can't tell the real deal from the copy. Yeah, whatever. Don't matter to me. I think I'll upgrade my BP next for sure. That's a green magic Koopa. It's a Koopa wizard dressed in green. Max HP is 7, attack is 4, and defense is 0. Its magic attack can also use magic to make itself or allies electrified or invisible. Oh, it also, it also says it'll use magic to make copies of itself when it's all alone. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. They all do. Yeah, who couldn't see that coming? Really? What am I supposed to do now? I can't attack it. Epic. Oh, that's gonna be fucking awful. Bye, bitch. <laughs> Can't believe that worked. Yeah! Anytime you care for another lesson, we'll be here. Mario! Yay! Whoa! Then if I storm it in, screaming his fool head off about something. Gonzalez has lost a foes, folks. Some who don't even know his name. Will he live? Word on the street was that some mustache dukeface was in Glissville, and looky here! Talk about perfect timing. And now all these folks have to watch me myrtleize you. Wait, the music goes crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna destroy you, and I have witnesses. Damn, wait, his theme slaps. Or I guess it's the battle music with him, but whatever. That's Bowser, but what is do what's he doing here? My mind just blew a fuse. Max HP is 30, attack is 30, and defense is 1. He's uglier than I expected. He's got a poisonous bite, so watch out. It'll make your HP decrease gradually. Also, if he ground pounds you, you won't be able to use one of your commands. Just focus your attention on beating him down, Mario. Owie. I can definitely block that. Um, can can I still attack you? Know, he's got the horns. I like forget. Wait, I thought I thought his defense was one. Then I just upgrade my boy. Am I crazy? Am I going insane?
Ah. Uh, I used to be so good at it once. <laughs> the noises are awesome. Wait, why'd that not poison him? Uh, I guess Coops, yeah? You bitch. Wait, I kinda wanna run away to see what happens. It would be funny. Ooh, well, if there's nothing less from you, Mario. Figures you get some licks in. Licks. Don't do it to me. Like, I don't think I, I... I have no thought I could beat him, but I really, really, really want to run away because I do think it'd be really funny. Especially because I've never done it before. <laughs> I knew I would rock you. Oh, that's got a sting. Man, I'm feeling about a million times better. I'm gonna go grab a soak. I thought he said sock, and I got scared. Whoa, okay, Gonzalez lost. Who would have thunk it, folks? It was this mystery fighter, anywho. It's just one mystery after another. That's so funny. Do I, like, have to do that battle again if I lost? I guess not. Um, was that King Bowser? What was he doing here? That kind of freaks me out. That's so funny. I kind of wish that it ended where it was like, Mars just like, no, I'm not going to bite you, actually. Bye. Uh, b -b -b fight, crawl, daddy, jump. Okay, well, that's good because it, I think he hurts. Sometimes he has his spear up, you know? Okay. The real question is, do I want to grind money now? <laughs> yeah. Dark gatekeeper. Yeah, but fight with the to finish with the craw daddy. We aren't gonna lose the likes of you. <laughs> Foolish mortals, I will drag you through the gate to the nether world. Alright, relax. No, 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 no. That's a dark craw. Yikes, what a ghastly looking spear thrower. Max HP is 20, attack is 6, and defense is 0. Wow, that's some serious attack power. You don't want to jump on it if it's spear pointing up, because that would hurt. Run of the mill spear tosser? He sure looks like he's got a point to make. Haha. -ha. Oh god. <laughs> I just wanted to see. Oh my god, if I could just maybe, like, attack. I 
I gotta upgrade my FP because of of him. Like, look how much FP this guy uses. Why does he use so much FP? Easy. I kind of wanted the star power from Bowser, to be honest, but whatever. <laughs> How'd that floor taste? Yeah, get owned, idiot. Oh, sounds like another male, huh? Go to telephone phone. Oh, let's do service again. We gotta go to some phone booth outside now. Or is the thing? I oh, will find it. Let's head outside. That's why I instinctually went to go to the phone when I was trying to find that key earlier. Gonzalez. Good time you put you little punk. Uncle Rockhawk's got some advice for you. If you keep stealing the spotlight from me, you're gonna enter a world of hurt. Quit making such a splash if you value your puny life. <laughs> yeah, you better keep walking, you punk chicken. You hear me talking? Hey, wait. I wonder, you think that idiot sent us that hate mail? I guess it doesn't matter if somebody hates us, so we better watch our steps. Uh, it doesn't matter to me, because I could own him, so whatever. And I will. So I, the thing I want BP upgraded is because I really want to equip um damage dodge, you know. I just realized I did solid tunes on this whole time. Guys, we don't even know what the music fucking sounds like. Oh my god. I just realized. Wait, so Bowser's theme slapped already. Oh no, wait, I think they make it so the ba the battle theme is still a dynamic like that. Oh my god, I feel so stupid. I've ruined the experience. What the hell are you I've ruined talking? everything. Oh, you can really hear the origami king in this. You do ruin everything. This is true. I do. <sighs> Go to the storage room next to Grubba's office. What the heck is this guy's problem? The storage room? I mean, does he think we need the exercise? This dude is really cheesing me off. I hear all the music now. She's back. She was gone for a bit. Ever since I met you, my happiness has been on decline. You ruined my happiness. Good. Just sound more detective-y, I guess. What the hell? She's never been in here before, right? Oh. <clears throat> we made again, you husky hun mustache hunk you. Are you Fernando Gonzalez? I didn't know you hung with crooks and you look like one. Get his ass. Get her ass. Security was talking about noises and- Oh wait, she wasn't here, actually. Did you make noise while you stole stuff? Oh, please. No one heard me. I'm the best mouse burglar of all time. I'm silent. It's quite obvious that someone else must have been monkeying about in here. Well, whatever. But you are a thief, right? Hush. 
All I need to know is that I've taken what I needed and now I'll be on my way. As for the rest, help yourself to whatever you like. And now we must part again, my sweet mustache man. Okay. That one's called a kiss? I heard about those things, I'm jealous. Only you get it? You're like two seconds old. I almost forgot my sweet. This arena holds my secrets, you know. You should be very careful. Lest you end up like those poor souls upstairs. And with that goodbye, my adjustable hunk of cheese. We shall meet again. Stop with the fucking back spam. Well, let's jig off, huh? What was that kiss like? I gotta get me one of those. Hey, what do you think? She meant that... What do you think she meant about someone being upstairs? Find a switch to reach the attic. A switch? So there's supposed to be a switch in here? Hmm. Easy. Charge P. I know how x ray work, buddy. I'm in a pre med program. Oh, good. Now I can upgrade my next partner. Uh... Oh, my God. I'm... Generate electricity by harnessing the energy released from nuclear fission and blah 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 blah. Know that, okay? Control rod, regulate the fission, blah 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 blah. Though highly efficient. I sure fucking did. What the hell? You act like I wasn't alive in like 2011. Everyone knows about that shit now. Plus, I had to watch. I forget what class it was in art school that I had to watch. All these different videos. I was like, every week we'd watch a new video about some horrible occurrence. Why we? What class was that? We watched like, it was about. Maybe it was a maybe it was a program, a TV show I was watching. It was about the various nuclear accidents that happened because of negligence, mostly being in India or Japan. Mostly India. So you didn't find hide or hair of nobody in the storage room, that what you're saying? Yes, Mr. Grubba. It appeared to be secure. Don't worry about it, sir. I take necessary precautions. It was mostly just a rat or something. Well, no big deal either way. Ain't nothing in there. We missed too much anyway. Thanks for staying on top of this, Julian. Hey, by the way, any, any word on King K? I'm afraid we still don't know the whereabouts of King K, Mr. Grubba. And so, I deleted a spot on our roster for regulations. This place no longer has any official connection to KPP, aka King K. I have, of course, taken the same steps with all the fighters who have gone missing. Whew, fighters sure have gone been missing a lot lately. That's the fifth this year. What in tarnation is going on? I even heard some security idiots saying the pit's cursed. I doubt that, sir, but I certainly don't understand this his appearance is. Well, for his time being, tell the other fellows that King K headed on home for a spell. If word, gets, if word gets out about missing fighters, it sure ain't gonna be good for business, no siree. Nasty rumors have a way of sending folks around to the hills, know what I mean? I understand completely, Mr. Grumma. I'll take care of everything, sir. 
You know, it's so early and you're a fine, dang fine manager, but your just plum disappears sometimes. I gotta know, where in the world do you go, darling? Uh, th that's... Mr. Grubba, I know you're my boss, but I don't believe that's any of your business. Easy, I don't mean to pry now. How about this then? Heard of the Crystal Star? No, no, I've never heard of such a thing, Mr. Grubba. Okie dokie. Well, I appreciate your time, Miss Jolene. You go ahead and run along now, you hear? Well, if this ain't a fine, how you, how do you do? Seems like good fighters are a dying breed. That wild child Gonzales is just about the only dry I still got around here. Whoa, Gonzales, whoa, did you hear that? Fighters are only missing, dude. This ain't, that ain't cool. It's like I talking about King K, the minor leaguer. I thought you were tired. <laughs> hey, somebody up there? Squeak. Who, Nelly? That's a little old mouse, and here I am thinking someone's up there a peeping. Mouse are mice are sentient in this game, are they not? It's, I don't know, buddy. I gotta relax, take some yoga classes or something. Yep, well, back to the ring. Whoa, whoa, man, we dodged a bullet there. Hey, but did you hear that guy blagging about the Crystal Star? That Julian lady acted pretty guilty when he let that one slip out. Well, whatever, for now we better bail before someone finds us up here. Somebody finds us up here, I can read. When do I get the key for this thing? I like forget it too. I forget everything, man. I didn't miss anything though. Hold on, so let's check. I could have sworn there was something hidden here, but maybe I'm going crazy. I'll take that. I've been missing about the freaking music the entire chapter. I'm so annoyed at myself. <laughs> uh. I'm just a silly, goofy little guy, man. What can I say? I need to drink something. I'm thirsty. Hammer, Bama, and Flare. Now listen, son. This battle, I want you to avoid using your hammer. Not even once. I want to say you do, and you ain't got something to beat a fella with. Now get in there, and let's see some acrobatifying. Beat a fella, huh? As long as it's not fucking not being allowed to attack. Oh my god, that's painful. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, bro. How could I forget? The fucking fighting music just slaps so much harder. For next blah, 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 blah. The big bad brute bros. Yep. Fight with the finish. Finish to the finish with the hammer, bama, and flare. My grandpa's hammer is gonna strike you down, man. Here it comes. I can't wait to hear the music. Bro, I've been missing this fucking epic music the whole time. I'm so pissed. I guess I can hear it again when I go through it again. Kind of reminds me of Splatoon music. That's a hammer, bro. You know him. He throws hammers, hence the name. Max HP is 7, attack is 4, and defense is 1. 
At least he drops and he thinks he's in trouble, he'll toss a hammer barrage. Nothing the about these guys has changed, they're stuffed for us ever, so brace yourself. Dang, this book always gives the important stuff. How do they carry endless hammers? I can't really do- I don't want to do that much until I get, um... Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> That's a fire bro. This relative of the hammer bro spits out fire. Max HP 7, attack is 3, and defense is 1. If you get hit by fireball, you might catch on fire, so garbal, okay? As HP gets low, he starts just he gets a friend and totally starts attacking like a fiend. Oh my god. I probably shouldn't have done that, I just realized. my life <laughs> ow I'm stupid as shit bro I don't know the burning the beating maybe the boomeranging okay yeah whatever buddy so I got a little beat up that's my bad sometimes like me a stupid little bitch that's okay How's my health? Am I hell healed up? No, I need to heal. <laughs> okay, well, let's try to not maybe do that again. Um, the fireballs are so fast, and the boomerang one, I... Uh, damn, bro, I got owned. They are ranked number three. Wait, what am I doing? <gasps> Whatever, he'll tell me. It's fine. <laughs> I just want to level up one more time before I fight uh, Rockhawk because I do want to get more BP. I thought it will matter that much, honestly. That fight's never been like particularly hard. What the fuck? They got items now. I had to peel the crowd three times. That's crazy. That's a crazy amount. Boomerang bro, the struggle of the hammer rose prefers boomerangs. As HP is 7, attack is 2, defense is 1. He attacks twice with his boomerangs on the way out and on the way back. As HP starts getting low, he fights all the harder. Prepare for multiple attacks. Great. I really missed the last one. That's crazy. Whatever. Fuck you. Right, right. They said the team, they really go for it with the thing there. Damn, bro. That is simply crazy. Let's do sweet tea, uh, and stuff. I only—I I literally don't think that I can um, even 
uh, hurt them right now, so. Rip. It's not like I need to be this fine. I, I timed those all like. I'm gonna die again! Are you not shitting me, bro? Never in my life, never in my life has this happened to me. I, the de and I feel like the delay wasn't this bad when I played it two years ago and i'm wondering if like the capture card is like getting worse or like the cable's worse or something or i did something i mean the software's worse so there's that i know that the capture software itself has gotten worse somehow but <laughs> jesus christ buddy I don't know if I've ever lost this battle in my whole life. I'm gonna cry. Um, don't want to see a battered hero. Got it. I'll try. I will certainly try. Don't know how it's gonna go because... To somehow kill them really fast. Um. Thanks. I could probably keep fighting them to level up. So I think I only have the helmety guy to go before I fight him, the big boy. last morning stop swimming around about the crystal star you don't suffer the same pain that the others who have gone missing this guy really needs to take a chill belly sure knows a lot though what's going on about the crystal star the missing fighters all that stuff tell you what we find this guy we have we'll have all the answers we need but who is this psycho i guess sworn it was cake time already maybe i have two more guys to fight before him Forehand, you know, oh yeah, I do. Why don't you wrap it up in five turns or less? I gotta do with my best gal. Okay. He's got many gals, and it's his best one he has to date with. Pardon me, Mr. Gonzalez. Another gift from, right from one of your admirers. I just read that like, like I am having a stroke. That's crazy. I'll leave it over here if that's okay. Do it with, do what, do with it what you will. Whatever she said. I don't know. Oh boy, cake! Too bad I'm already fully healed. Damn, what a shame. Never, 
They're better than or fear orbs. Yeah, but face the fish was champ country. <laughs> they got a dog in them. Just like Lyos. That's red chomp, it's rabid, red, biting, chewing, chomping, cool. Yeah, max HP is 6, attack is 5, and defense is 3. This attacks are powerful, so we could be in a world of hurt if we don't beat it fast. Which is why it's really, really annoying that its defense is so high. Its HP is pretty low, though. Just look at the color. I think someone painted it after it fell asleep at a party. Ow! A little bit sooner than that, I guess. All right, Mark, get him. Hi. the floor taste. Hey, get him. Prepare to fight my 24 coins, Mr. Gonzalez. Yippee. Damn. What, 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 Gonzalez, is he doing the floor back there? Ugh, body you went um stupid cake 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 never eat cake again. Was that cake poisoned? Yeah, must have been. If we'd eaten it, we'd be all banged up like that guy. I still could have beaten the match, though. It would have been easy peasy. Easiest fight of my life, quite frankly. Uh, right. Our last one before we fight the the rock hawk himself. <sighs> that name is crazy. The Coopinator. No swapping partners out. Oh dear. Maybe I'll just do it twice and get the money. There's just no way that I'm willing to beat him, like, without Yoshi. It's gonna take me 18,000 years. <laughs> the Razor Blade Brig Brigadier! Yep, fight to finish with the Hoopinator! You, finally get a piece of you. Finally we'll see who's truly stronger. Edgy frick. I must go crazy. It's a dark Koopa patrol. These guys are just totally ooze toughness, don't you think? Nice speed is 25, attack is 5, defense is 2. After a charge of power, its next attack will be devastating. Try to survive it. It's almost like those red eyes are there to warn you just how tough it is. Or maybe it just doesn't, just doesn't get much sleep. Real. Never mind, this be easy. Right. 
These guys ain't shit once you get them on their back. That's crazy. Damn, I always manage to stop it the one before it. Of course, if I also break the rules, I'll probably level up before I get to, um, Rockhawk. Yeah? That's just so true, Potato Stealer 15. Oops. Oh well. I'll just level up with him, I guess. No biggie. Yeah, that you are right. That was no biggie. Alright, I guess I could do the other kind of match. Hey, it's the mail. What do you think? Our ex-friend of the hater raider. I made a horse on drugs. I like that with like the little thing you just pasted because I feel like I don't see it. Maybe it's my fault. Maybe if I go on mobile. <laughs> Let's see. If it doesn't look like a horse on drugs, I'm banning you, to be clear. <laughs> How did I go to my own channel? Chat. Ooh. Where'd you make the horse with drugs, buddy? <laughs> you drew it. Okay. I wish I could draw horses. That's a pretty impressive skill, actually. I think I've drawn like five horses in my time and they were all not good. I'll tell you that much. I can't even draw. All right, I feel like you're just, you're just, you're just, you're just pulling my chain as they say. I don't know why I'm even blowing these ones off. I'm pretty sure it's the one up here. Yay! Supposed to be a dinosaur. <laughs> Fell. Go to the second floor of the storage room. Yo, yo, Greg Gonzalez, two questions. How's your mindset? If you weren't a jungle animal, what noise would you make? Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Let me get some snaps of you, Gonzalez. Um, you know, I just realized I must be in love with him or something. I saw just thinking about him. I just realized we're getting like a whole progression of her story. If the sun is in space, why is there light on Earth but not in space? But you've come to the wrong place to ask rhetorical questions because I have an answer for you. It's the same reason why there's no sound in space. Um, and there is light in space. If you think about if I don't know what you mean there's no light in space. Things just look dark out there. But if you go into space, you are lit up. Your body is still lit up. It's not like there's no light in space. You just see the blackness because there's nothing there. There's so little stuff there that is just void because nothing, no light is reflecting off of it. 
Um, and no light is coming in from stars because there's no stars there either. Or it's just too far and dissipates by the time it gets to us. Or it hasn't even gotten to us yet. But the reason why the sound doesn't reach, there's no sound is because there's no space is that. Just that. It's just empty. There's a lot of empty space out there. And uh, there's not enough things to bounce around the sounds. And light. Space is cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> no problem. I, anytime. You, if you got any more questions for me, feel free to ask. <laughs> Whoa. You gotta be kidding me. Bandy Andy and King K. Ooh. God, Gonzalez. Listen to me. Ugh, man, don't get near the ring when no one is around. Oh. Come on, shake it off, buddy. What do you mean? Don't go near the ring. King K, you were retiring. Don't let this... Don't die. Gonzalez, you see that? That was Jolene. This is craziness. What is going on in here? I don't know, man. Wackiness. Pure, unadulterated wackiness. Let's go kill Rockhawk. Okie dokie. Let's go. Great Zalas, howdy, face for a fight, huh? <laughs> Guess what your next match is? The title match. Hooey, darn tune, you're up against the champ, Rock Hawk. Now, I want to see a fair and excited match. Don't you let me down now, you hear? Now, listen, son. In this battle, there are no conditions. You fight the champ with every trick and technique you got. Now get in there and win yourself a championship. Of course. <laughs> you, should you ever face me again, you will know the pain of utter defeat. You fight on, Mr. Gonzalez. I'm gonna keep fighting too. Oh, he's so cute. You know, I'm actually a little jealous of your hammer. I mean, your skill. But forget skill, I'm gonna try harder than you. And become a champion anyway. What is it like? No, you're so close to stop, huh? Don't get a big head, baby. Alright, let's go. I've talked to my companions. I'm ready. Hey, where do you think you're going, pal, huh? The ring's this way. Yeah, uh, you go this way, because it's a special match. I need to put my hands on the controller. I can just chill out right now. Slow down, will you, buddy? Why are we going this weird way again? <laughs> you two wait here. Huh? This is a minor league locker room. And speaking of which, where is everybody? I know I said to wait here, but... Mario, we're gonna miss our fight against the champ. I fell. <laughs> no, don't fall! <laughs> now for today's main event. The top dog in the major league, the great Gonzalez. is finally gonna throw down with the champ. The one. The only. Rockha. First into the rain, the Golden Grandstand of Rock Hawk! You go, champ! Rock him! Go, champ! You rock him! 
Who dog is Tam High feeling center challengers a handful? You don't want a handful of this. Uh uh. There's only one champ, and it's me. Even if it's Gonzalez Wish ever shows up, what's he gonna do, huh? Nothing. Well, the great Gonzalez made it to the top of the majors faster than anyone ever. He even got up here faster than you did, champ. What do you guys say about that? What did I just say? That's what. Who cares what this guy did to a bunch of chumps? Cause now he's gonna get- now he gets rocked! <laughs> okay, they're like totally ridiculously late, ridiculously late now. I'm gonna find out what's up. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Mario. It's locked, the door's locked. We're totally trapped. And now for Challenger, the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez! Hold the phone, folks! What the heck is going on? What happened to the Great Gonzalez? <laughs> I'll tell you what happened. He fears the rock! Woo-wee! What a stupefying development, folks! Did the Great Gonzalez really turn yellow and head for the hills like a dog? I'll tell you what, folks, you don't show soon, he's gonna he's gonna forfeit the match. Mario, if we don't do something soon, we're gonna forfeit that match. We gotta get out of here. The music is way more intense than the original, I think. Well, I just want to see there's free stuff for me, okay? Oops. Okay. One. Interesting. Sorry, I love exploring too much. Ooh. I never actually opened these lockers in my other playthroughs, to be honest. Not that I think you would get stuff out of them. So there was nobody in here, huh? That's like actually so gross. <laughs> Wait. Ew. Especially if somebody was in here. I hope that we never do that again. Oh, we're in the Major League locker room quickly to the arena. Yeah, that was that was pee gross. I hope I don't waste my life stream. I'll be really sad. The moment you waited for, folks, the Great Gonzalez just entered the arena. Gonzalez, Gonzalez. Well, looks like we actually made it. Listen to those cheers, Mario. They love you. Come on, let's get, let's go put this oversized rooster in his place, huh? Guys, he's named Rockhawk, and he's a rooster. They knew. They knew what they were doing. And I didn't for so long. 
Just listen to this crowd hoot and holler for the challenger. Great Gonzalez. Will his hammer of hurt and harm be enough to rock the rock hawk socks? Now, at long last, the battle to end all battles is here. Let's keep it clean, boys. Get those right to battle! My brother's here! Yay! Okay, Mario, this is it. A match with the champ. Let's destroy this guy. <laughs> you should have stayed locked up safe and sound. What? What are you saying? Don't tell me it was you who got the security guard to lock us up. You're darn right I did. I'll say the poison cake, suckers. That's what happens when you mess with me, baby. You meet the pain train. So you're the drink that's been sending us mean emails with the crystal star. Huh? I have no idea what you're ta babbling about now. What's a crystal star? No, wait. I don't care. I mean, I don't exactly play fair, but I got skills, punk. And now you're about to meet them all, baby. Prepared to be robbed. <laughs> That's Rockhawk. He flips, flaps, and slaps, as the book says. His max HP is 40, attack is 4, and defense is 0. He's really good at aerial maneuvers, but on the other hand, other than that, he's pretty meh. One thing you should know is that Rockhawk never fights above the board. Carelessness leads to lifelessness, you know. Nice. Nice. Oh, come on. Thank God. Not too shabby. You're better than I thought. This may actually be fun. Don't you get... Don't get your head swelled, though. Because you got a ways to go. Check this out. Time to rock! Alright, Mark. Do your thing. God, the music absolutely fucks in this. That's crazy. Wow, not a single one worked. That's crazy. Ow! All the punies ran away. That's cringe. What the hell just happened? Miss the timing for the stylish again. Yes. Finally, I got one. This bitch is fucking dead, though. This fight is this fight is easy squeeze lemon peasy, man. Of course. Man, you're kind of annoying. How dare you turn the rock up back on the hawk? I should have just taken care of you before the battle. I'm getting lazy, I guess. Well, since this come, uh, baby, baby. Well, since this come, since this come down to this, I guess I got no choice but to. I got most of those, I think. Okay, yeah, bitch, you're fucking dead. Bye. Hi! Easiest fight of my fucking life, bro. No! <laughs> I've rock hogged the champ, the undefeated master. I've lost to such losers. Oh, shit. I didn't even level up from that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Folks, I feel my like my eyes just popped out of my head. We got ourselves a miracle.
Technique versus technique, raw power versus raw power, a clash of superhumans. Folks, this was truly honest, without a, without question, no doubt, absolutely. The most legendary, amazing, improbable history-making bout of all time. And the victor in this match for the ages was the great Gonzalez. Congratulations, Gonzalez, you're the champion, son. Give him a hand, folks. The new Bliss Pit champ, the great Gonzalez. I'm so pissed I did not level up from that. One point away. One point away from leveling up. Are you kidding me? Well, you finally did, son. Today is your first day as the new champ. Jolene, hand him the fight money. Here's your fight money of 100 coins for Mr. Gonzalez. Tell you what, I'm gonna go ahead and get you set up in the champ's room right away. Miss Jolene, be a peach and show Gonzalez hit the champion's room, okay? Absolutely, sir. Well then, Mr. Champion, would you please follow me? Bye, bitches! Okay, can we walk a little faster, maybe? No, I wanted the picture of Rockhawk on the wall. Congratulations again, Mr. Champion. From now on, this is where you'll stay. It's your home now, so make yourself at home. You will use the terminal as you always have, of course. Will there be anything else? Then have a nice day, Mr. Champion. Yippee! Yeah, 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 yeah. We finally made it, Gonzalez, but... You know, Rockhawk really sounded clues about the Crystal Star. We still don't have any leads on that thing. I mean, where the heck could it be? Hang on, Gonzalez. You hear that? A voice is coming from somewhere. It's one of the seven green mysteries. It's a ghost. You think it's a ghost? Yes. I do think it's a ghost, actually. Hey, 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 do you have to have the thing turned up? That scared me silly. Discover the true nature of the ghost from X. There's actually a ghost? Okay, that is not cool. Ghosts are scary. Truing. Ghosts are scary. There's booze in the game. They're pretty spooky, man. This is awesome. I wonder what the carpet material is. Wait, can they go behind this picture too? No. Am I just thinking of pi of uh of uh Mario Sunshine? I think. <laughs> I think I'm just thinking about Mario Super Mario Sunshine. My bad. Absolutely fucking like launch that into the thing here. We're in the air duct, right? Where does it lead? <laughs> well, that's in perfect condition as usual. Yep, as long as I got that baby working for me, this old bot ain't never gonna get weak. But I'm gonna watch my tootsies here for a bit. First, let that King K idiot walk in on me when I was with that. And now I can't shake the feeling that Jolene and Gonzalez are on to me. Well, I guess I'll burn that bridge when the time comes. I'll just disappear them. Yep, just like did them others. Like that did that pr Prince Mush, the first champ. Boys, it's Greba, so he's behind all those missing fighters? I better lock this room up tighter in a peanut butter jar at a squirrel convention. And I'll just go ahead and hide that paper into that in the desk drawer. There we go, you know what though? Since I'm 
I'm thinking aloud here. Good fighters ain't nothing to mess with. Even Rockhawk lost to Gonzalez. This new champ might have to disappear pretty soon for my sake. I'm just saying, um... I talk to myself aloud a lot, so I can't even be like, oh, that's crazy that he does that. I think he's gone. Let's, let's check out that desk drawer of his. Because I do that. What am I going to say? That's weird to do. I do that. I think I'm doing it right now. You think about it. Whoa, bingo. I bet that's the paper old grubba hit. Check it out, Gonzalez. Yo, a machine out of the ring using crystal star? These are the blueprints. I don't know what the rest of this nerd talk says, but I think the crystal star powers it. If this paper's right, then the machine can suck the power out of people. Yuck. Oh crud, you think that King K and Bandy Andy got all drained or something? Yes, I do think that. Great gallop and gulp it. How much did you get in here, son? Well, slap me and call me Sassafras. You're staring at my screw paper, too. Shut up, you make me sick. Why'd you drain King K and Bandy Andy, huh? They were the goats. Whoa, well, Nelly, this ain't good. After him, Gonzalez, let's go beat his ass. Yeah. Like, you said, like, assume that he went in here. All right, I got a, I got a life stream. There's no way I lose this battle. <laughs> Yeah, I want to check. I'm pretty sure there's no thingies in here because they only put them in places you can revisit. But you just never know, man. Er, wait, I got put. Whatever, doesn't matter. I have insta change. I gotta say, y'all are a couple slack jawed idiots <laughs> sniffing around my business. Now that you know my big secret, I'm afraid you're gonna have to take a little old dirt nap. This music goes crazy. I feel like, again, I feel like all the music is too extra, like it's too much. But the boss, like the battle music, it just makes sense, you know? It's almost up there, that's the crystal star, right? <laughs> How you like my machine? Pretty dang nice, huh? Yep, I've been sick and power from Rise of this baby slurp. You're down too, and you know why? Because it keeps my body for your ever young, son. You're such a sump scumbag. You're gonna pay for using Crystal Star like that, freak. Oh, just shut your traps now. I'll use my Crystal Star however I dang please. Check this out. Her muscle up. Macho Grubba. Yo, Grubba beefed up. Hooey, I must smush you guys to guacamole and snack on your energy too. Okay, that baseline though. Okay. Damn. Powerhouse now, you pestering little pieces of prairie piffle. The longs of this. I have this here machine, my bottle be rough, tough, and ultra buff. Let's rock and all. I'm ready to chew this dude up and spit him out. Actually, I wonder if it's better to um, use Mark's uh, like mini egg first. Nice. And then I'll like tattle on him. 
This hair, the, the, the guitar goes crazy in this song, though. To be honest with you. More chances to attack are now available. I remember that being a thing he can do. That's new. He didn't do that before. At least never when I played. That's Monster Groba. He's Groba all souped up on Crystal Star Power. Max HP is 60, attack is 4, and defense is 0. His attack pattern is simple. First he increases the number of times he can attack. Then he powers himself up with all sorts of wild power up he moves. So it's pretty important to pay attention close attention when, to how he's powered himself up. The wildest thing about this most set is, is that he was just regular little Grubba a moment ago. I guess the crystal stars really are powerful. Defense up. Okay. Only I managed to dodge that. All right, Mark, your time to shine. Maybe you better just to wait until he. You'll be kidding me. Don't laugh at me. Oh, yeah, keep it spicy. Wait, uh, keep it spicy. You know, I love a good tussle, Gonzalez. Keep on scrapping, son. Coerce it ain't gonna do you much good in the end. Really? That is crazy. Interesting. I don't want to, um... Yeah, I figured he might miss that. I think it's like normal attacks will miss always. Maybe not always, but most of the time? I don't know. I'm getting better at the timing now with this bingo thingy. Attack up three, of course. Oh, you bitch. Nice, nice, nice. Too shabby, Gonzalez. You got showmanship and that's gold in this biz. But this here battle's just getting started. It's time I show you some real moves. Back in the day, I had so many rum kicking moves, they had to make some illegal. The fuck, he got bigger. That's like new. I, like, pretty much never use Clock. I pretty much only use uh, Earth Tremor and Sweet Tree, to be honest. This is the last time, too, and I made a, a effort to try to use the other ones. Damn it. Oh 
why is he just allowed to do that? I feel like that's really cringe, to be honest. Oh my god, did I tattle on him? I did, okay. I don't know why I like temporarily forgot temporarily forgot that I tattled on him. This is actually a lot harder, I think, than the initial one. Even though like it's still easy, I feel like uh they've made it a little harder. They added some new stuff. Which is nice. Um, it's the star. I, di I didn't. I didn't even make my an effort to time that just then. That was weird. <laughs> I stopped it randomly. What the hell? My hands are so sweaty, guys. I don't even know why. I just got sweaty hands today, I suppose. Oops. I mean, it maybe it's because it's 80 degrees in my room or something, but... Ugh. I ain't finished yet, Gonzalez. I ain't over till it's over, that's the way it goes in combat sports, son. And let me tell you something, Fortune's gonna smile at me on the end, punk. I don't know about that, Chief. I'm built different, so... Like, it's kind of Jover for you, buddy. Yeah, do all you want, buddy, but you're about to get gulped. So... <laughs> I was just waiting since when I'm playing an FPS game. Well, I'm not exactly playing an FPS game, huh? <laughs> I just got, like, a firm fucking grip on the controller right now. Ugh. Yippee! All the, all the money I can spend on the casino now! Oh, Isn't that exciting? Any game? I get sweaty when I play FPS games. Not usually other games, though. It's just really hot. BP. Even though I also need more FP. Really bad. Became a B list star. Next battle, Mario's crowd and stage will get bigger. No, how'd this happen? How could a perfect bot like Mario lose to such a schlub? Oh, great, Gonzalez. Great fight there, son. Great fight. Uh. <laughs> Mr. Champion. No, I mean, Mario. Please allow me to offer my earnest thanks for defeating that foul grubba. Jolene, I really have to apologize. I'm so sorry I had to get you involved. But you must understand, I had to learn the truth about this arena by any means. Let me tell you everything. I had a little, little brother once by the name of Mush. He's done anything for me. 
Our friend was always poor, so he became a fighter here to support all of us. But he suddenly went missing one day. Our family was inconsolable. I suspected foul play, so I got hired on as the manager investigating a secret. As I looked for clues about my brother, I suddenly saw Grub Mr. Grubber transform. Seeing what I was up against, I almost gave hope. And then you appeared. So I decided to secretly guide you. Ah, so our ex-buddy was... Correct, it was me. Once I saw you fight, I knew you were the one, who, only one who could challenge Grabba. Now, sir. No, not sir. Grubba. I want answers right now. What did you do with my precious little brother? You know exactly what I'm talking about. The first champion, Prince Mush. Uh, Prince Mush, he... He discovered the secret of my power sucking machine. I had him uh, disappear. Anyway, any which way you look at it, ooh, he ain't around these parts no more. No! I... I suspect as much. Oh, poor sweet mush. Well, I thought she was kind of mean, but it turned out she was just worried for her brother. Oh, check it out, Gonzalez, the crystal, the crystal star! <laughs> What a little guy. Oh my god, he's like animated. What voice is that? I just realized that I've been giving a toad a not toad voice. <laughs> what is this? I bet it's a glitch pit. Oh, is that really you, sis? What are you doing here? I was just... There, there, Mush. It's okay. It's all over, finally. Is that what the Crystal Stars can do? Now, yeah, Mario, the Crystal Stars yours. What if I want to use the machine on myself? I think that might be fun. Have you considered that? Whoa, are you sure it's okay if we just take it? Better that you have it, so nothing like this ever happens again. It's all you, Gonzalez. Nab it, dude. You got a crystal star! Your star power is now four. I learned the special move power lift. Woohoo! on her side was a dark, dangerous place seething with conspiracy. With the help of the lovely Miss Jolene, Mario revealed Grubba's true identity. Acquired the third crystal star by defeating the monstrous Macho Grubba. Grubba had used the power of the crystal star to run his power draining machine. What other hidden powers might these strong, uh, these strange and mystical items possess? Longest chapter. I feel like I went through it pretty fast, too. Beldum, tell me what good are you? You still haven't taken care of that Mario character? But yes, yeah, sorry, but only because he's tougher than we thought at first. You do understand that we ex must open the thousand-year door first, do you not? He will, rest assured I will definitely nail him next time. Nail him? <laughs> We prepared a weapon that will bring him to a quick and certain end. What would you do if you woke up as a fish? Probably like swim. I trust your words, though I rapidly lose my patience. Just leave it outside. Oh, so we're on the on the on the next my favorite my second favorite chapter, which is my favorite aesthetic chapter. Next. Okay. So true. No doubt about it. I'm officially bored. Wait. Mario! Mario! Those awful exons! 
Uh, X things haven't been back to ask about the map. Maybe they don't care about it anymore. Oh boy, it's time for deck. But first, I would go to the Titanic. Well, I guess it depends on what ocean you're in. You can't just go to the Titanic if you're not in the Atlantic Ocean. What if you're in the Pacific Ocean? And how would you even know where it is? Could you navigate that? If you can't navigate it now as a human, I don't think you could even navigate it as a fish. Maybe, maybe think next time before you decide what you will do as a fish, hmm? Also, certain fish live at certain depths. You don't even know if the fish type that you've been born as can even go that deep. <laughs> I just go anywhere. Fair. I miss Peach's little umbrella in the original game. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, hold on, guys. I might have to be right back. I might have to be right back. Hold on. I lived. Oh guys, we can put the robot voice on. That's right. The the robot voice on uh my 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 thing. Okay, here we go. Hello, Princess Peach. You always call me in without warning, Tech. Was it this time? I apologize. I would like you to go to where Sir Gross is and ask him something. <laughs> Uh, no, I won't stop! <laughs> what? What do you mean, go ask? It enhances the stream. I recently obtained specific information that brought an issue to my attention. You are the main computer here, right? Why is there anything you don't know? I am unable to know things that are not entered into my CPU or otherwise recorded. That is why I want to know what Sir Gross is thinking about this issue. But Tech, what about your GPU? Can I play Valorant? <laughs> can I run, can I run Subnautica? But even if I go try to go see him, they'll catch me and send me back to the room. When you go AFK, you just look into my soul. <laughs> That's because I am looking into your soul. <laughs> that is 
true, but you will find a soldier's room one floor up. Take the elevator. Once there, please obtain a soldier's uniform and change into it, avoiding detection. You will go see Sir Grotus looking like a soldier. You may not be disguised. I imagine you won't take no for an answer, will you? You imagine correctly. Alright, fine, I guess. Well, so what do you want me to go ask Grotus? I want you to ask. Where will Tech want me to ask about that? He sure is a weird computer. Mario. Mario? Oh, is the elevator you want me to go in? Yes. I dost to believe it. Please wait just a moment. There is currently a soldier in the vicinity. Huh? Now, Princess Peach, after leaving the elevator, head to the right. It is a room nearby with a green lamp. It's funny that he says, like, to the right instead of, like, well, because what if it's because me kind of the elevator technically is my left, you know? Please change here, quickly. The shoulders uniform should be in a locker. I saw look in all the lockers. Nothing cool. Hmm. Oh, is this the uniform? Am I supposed to wear? Uh, am I supposed to wear this ugly thing? Yes, that is correct. This is emerge immersion, guys. <sighs> Oof. I don't know about this. It's awfully tight and kind of smells a bit. Phew. Who knows how, but I got into it. I can barely breathe, though. She's cool. I bet I look perfect. She's awesome. I love Peach. Wait, the music now is kind of slaps. I love their cinema roll hats. Uh, excuse me, Sir Grotus. That's my that's my impression of Peach doing a manlier voice. Uh, uh, well, it's about Princess Peach. What do you plan to do with her going forward? How are your voices worse than the last time you played the other Paper Mario game? What are you talking about? My voices are goaded. Shut the fuck up. Hmm? Something is wrong with your voice, x not <laughs> Perhaps I have a throat lozenge. No, well, never mind. Oh, about Princess Peach. I have no interest in what that woman has to say. Just keep her locked in her room. Don't ever, ever treat her roughly, understand? Tell the others as well. But, uh, why... Why in the world are we keeping her here, then? That's none of your business. Don't forget your place, you impudent worm. Concentrate on getting the crystal stars. That's all I require of you. We ex need the legendary treasure to conquer the world. Don't forget it. Conquer the world? Legendary treasure? What are you blathering about now? Hmm, something is odd about you. Uh, no, 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 nothing odd. So, uh, Roger, or whatever, please excuse me. My voices are goaded. Shut the hell out your mouth, buddy. Oh, that was unnerving. Oh, stuff about conquering the world. Talk about creepy. I 
wonder if that has anything to do with collecting the crystal stars. Cope? Ah, 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 Off with this thing. Phew, good old pink dress, my favorite. Why would I ever wear anything different? I better get back click quickly. You're just mad because you don't you're you're too impressed by my robot voice. I know what the problem is. Heck, you tear a machine, so your goal is to conquer the world, is it? Of course, after all, I was built for that purpose. Conquering the world, how could you? Princess Peach, allow me to ask you something. Do you like the world you live in? There are many problems in the world, many sorrows. Do you like such a world? Of course I do. Nobody likes everything about the world, but I love the good parts. There are many sorrows, sure, but there is also joy. Is that so? Tell me, will crystal stars help you conquer the world, and what's with this treasure? I am afraid I cannot answer. Answering those questions is prohibited, is prohibited by Sir Grotis. Well, but... Oh, never mind. I must at least inform Mario about this awful plan for world domination. Tech, let me use your communicator. I suppose I can allow that. Please use the communicator. Dear Mario... These guys are fucked up. Send it this instant. <laughs> They're trying to take over the world. What the hell? <laughs> the message has been sent. Well then, Princess Peach, you have had a busy day. Go back to the room, please. Oh, okay. I mean, I didn't even know it was a day because I don't have any fucking windows. So how would I know that? Bitch. <laughs> Good night, Princess Peach. Bow, bow, bow. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Did that, that thing's humongous. Everybody hide now. Save yourselves. Who would have thought that fool Mario would be in Glitzville of all places? Did you say something, your rudeness? No, uh, no, nothing at all. As far as you know. Hey, see those little bite sized shrimps? What were those things? Those were some beauties. Some of them should know about the crystal star. I fear you, so they're all hiding. Let's find them all and force them to tell us about the crystal star. Yikes, this guy's big and bad. He's large and in charge. <laughs> You're scary, Mr. Giant Bad Breath Monster. Don't worry, Petunia, your, your big brother's here. We'll get through this. Be gone! <laughs> you are them, aren't you? What are the evildoers you built? Our crystal star? Ha! See? I knew it! This ugly thing knows what the crystal star is! Tell us! How rude! Ugly thing, how dare you! You versus Crone, I am the great puny elder! Me, my heart don't serve me like that, I'm too old for this stuff! Tag versus tag, awesome! Uh, Emma, Lord Bowser, looks like just dying to say something! Uh, nope, nothing. Let's move on, shall we? You, Elder Hag thing, where's the crystal star? I can't do this voice anymore, guys. My throat. And don't try pulling rank again. Your heads are not your age will determine your fate. <laughs> I think, honestly, in any case, you're too late. Crystal star's already gone. Oh, what? Right, you were thing. We gave the mustache to a man named Mario. I was collecting the crystal star to rescue some princess. What do you call her? Princess Pinch? Yep. We'd love to save that lucky lass. It's Mario! 
Ah, uh, Mario, this day's versus Peach. Uh, not versus Pinch, this day's versus Peach. Oh, your sonality is behind, besides the point. Princess and the Crystal Stars must be connected. Mario's trying to get it all. Treasure's princess, does this greed ever end? That fucking freak. The Jackal. Both Princess Peach and the Crystal Stars belong to me. If I find I'm gonna finish them off once and for all, I swear it. I don't know why I became Southern briefly there. <laughs> so now you must leave. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I understand. If you must, you must. We won't delay you. You'll be seen to find the rest of the crystal stars. Good luck. Gonzalez, I wanna eat I'm gonna tell you rock hop ain't gonna fight dirty anymore. I'm gonna hit the weights, take some vitamins, and win the title fair and square. And I'm never ever gonna lose again. Remember when life rocks, you rock back. What the fuck am I listening to? What do you mean? What are you what are you saying? What are you what do you mean? Explain yourself, huh? Say it a little louder, hmm? Listen, G Money, thanks for everything, man. You're the nicest dude I've ever met. If you ever need it, I've got your back. Me, I think I'm gonna chill here and improve my skills. King 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 K's back, baby. It's all thanks to you. You're my boy, Mario. Now that Grandma's out of the picture, I'm gonna take over running the Gliss Pit. If you ever decide to return the ring, just come back. I'll keep your spot open. You have tons of fans, and they'd absolutely love it for me to come back. Anyway, think it over, okay? Travel safe. Okay! <laughs> Man hates my voice acting. What the hell? I put my whole... I put my whole body into it. Sweet, another crystal star. That's three, right? You better roll back to rogue for it, don't you think? Yo! Whoa, whoa. I'm fucking out of here. Hey, my voice is so much, then why do you listen to him? Oh. <laughs> what the fuck goofy goober voices are these? Listen, I'll have you know all my voices are supposed to be goofy, okay? Alright, I'll have you know it's intentional. Except for one of them. But still. Bro, I put my whole thrussy into that. My whole throat gets wrecked every time I do one of these streams, man. And you're just like, oh, what the hell is this? <laughs> what? I'm not appreciated, man. Nobody appreciates me. Ain't right. Alright, let's go deliver this crystal star. <laughs> you're a what? I see what I said. It's all you got an email. Mario, I haven't covered something terrible. These things, the x knots they're planning to take control of the world. It's to the end that they're seeking the crystal stars and trying to claim legendary treasure. Treasure. I still don't know what that treasure is, but you must hurry and gather the crystal stars. I will gather with the information I can, Princess Peach. Those who want to rule the world? That would stink. <laughs> That's so true, buddy. I guess I'm Jerry. I'm a bob um, from Plump Belly Village. Nice meeting you. Sorry I sound so down, but you would be too if you seen Luigi's big bridal stunt show. He's so clumsy in heels. He was like a wildly force of nature, falling down everywhere, knocking things over, tumbling into people. And I have an obligation to tag along and clear the area if Luigi so much as glances at a stiletto. Someone has to be the herald of the coming wobble apocalypse. That's why I'm sticking close to this guy. What? He what? He wore what? Okay, it's been a long time since I since I actually listened to Luigi tell his stories. That's interesting. Rookie, the great Gonzalez takes Glissville by storm and, ups and upset on the way. Upset happened, buddy. Hawk Hawk may be strong, but he's no Prince Mush, is he? No, he's not. A fighting Fian. 
Well, silver, we're gonna look for the crystal star and like, that's it, bro. I'm done so. Five hours of voice acting is crazy. I feel like my voice, like, I always can like breathe better by the end of it. When I start stream, I like can't breathe. Uh, and then like I clear out my throat, my sinuses are cleared, like it's beautiful. Okie dokie. Does anyone else in Mario even have titties? Other than that one bird lady in Mario RPG? Cause she's clothed and this girl isn't. Sorry, I just that's, that's all I can think about every time she's out. <laughs> they might say that thickerita po post. Titties out, choker on, no fucks given. <laughs> thickerita. <laughs> I don't know where that that post goes, but hell yeah, bro! Best level after the one we just did. Oh my god, I'm so excited to see it. Stop! <laughs> what you've never seen that post? Yeah, shows where the fourth crystal star is. Guess we'll have to go at the show this to that Frankly guy. But first, we better tell him about what Princess Peach's email said, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank God I had to travel up there myself. I'm lazy. What? <laughs> the group that kidnapped Princess Peach is bent on a total world conquest. Uh-huh, you got that right. That's why those jerks need that legendary treasure. Hmm, this doesn't bode well. The situation has gotten far more serious than I thought. Let me bring you up to speed. I've been researching just what this treasure could be. One book I came across held to what I thought was a preposterous theory. This book claimed the treasure was in actuality the Great Cataclysm. The very cataclysm. Yep, the cataclysm. That a thousand years ago sank that town underground. So these jerks think the power of the ca that cataclysm will help them rule the world? I can't say the word cataclysm. I'm really struggling with this one. I can't say for sure what they will do or why, but we must consider the possibility. Now that things have come to this, we must have let them near the legendary treasure. That's all that matters, because if they do get it, then once again this town... No, oh, the entire world could be destroyed. These voices aren't even consistent? Leave me alone! <laughs> I'm not professional! For a whole bear on my face, it's crazy! <laughs> now this prof, we gotta find the next crystal star super quick. Hmm, according to the map, it appears the next crystal star is in Twilight Town. Twilight Town? To tell you the truth, I don't know much about the place myself, only rumors. I have heard that, as the name implies, it's perpetually dim and eerie there. Wait just a moment. Uh huh. There appears to be a pipe to Twilight Town somewhere here in Rogueport. I do believe somewhere underneath the west part of town. Yes, definitely. If you're stuck for any reason, just come back see me again, okay? Underground west part of the town? Check. Gotcha, proof. Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> what? Oh, what? <laughs> come on, Gonzalez. The fuck did I just read there <laughs> in my own brain? Koopy Koo, miss you. RDM issue two. Come to light that after settling into a life at our inn, Toesworth has often been spotted the company of Zesty. Notoriously finicky, Zesty surprised all when she was heard saying, What's wrong with spending my time with little total to toes? Toodle, total toes? 
possibilities slash a comment opens. Oops. Has our eyes and ears glued to the situation? Our focus of the attention this week? Pungent, pungent's great tree shop. Pungent's easygoing management philosophy is money and customers are fickle, so easy come, easy go, you know? Philly understands why his job isn't busier too. Well, we're hidden. We're well hidden. I can read, guys. I promise. But like any good treasure, we're worth looking for. He even has a special offer. RDM readers. For the next 15 minutes, I'll give you double shop points. Today's MR recipe. Spicy soup. Steep a fire flower in hot water and presto, you're done. I already got that. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, that's too much mail to read at this moment in time. I gotta go... I gotta go get those double shot points, man. Guys, I've had a headache for like two weeks straight because every day Mabel wakes me up really early and it's like messing up my entire life, to be honest with you. I don't know what to do. Even my sleep medication's not enough. Yeah, I wouldn't know where that one goes, actually. That floor texture could be anywhere. Alcohol. No, I only asked the answer. I think I will actually die <laughs> if I do that. I'm pretty sure I will perish. Can't even have fucking. Can't even have Sprite because of my medication, man. You think I can have alcohol? No. No. Leave me alone. It's always the answer. I don't know about that, Chief. Maybe you should see somebody. It's fight juice, brave juice, and EP juice all in one. True. We just get like a fuck ton of mysteries and just see what happens. Wait, well, do some in battle though. Um. I'll just buy the the sh mushrooms, I guess. I mean, look how much money I have. What are the points thingies, actually? Um, 20 points for Ice Storm, Super Mushroom, Thunder Rage, Shooting, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I don't really need any of this stuff. I can just go buy it myself. I don't know why I'm doing this. I love this guy. Okay, that's great. I'm just trying to store stuff. I also am out of, like, storage space, too. Um, Ice Storm. Yippee! Six hours is nothing. I'm gonna put that one in storage. Um. 
I want to buy badges, I think, with my stuff. No, we're ending here, so I'm gonna go back to Rogueport, uh, and then that will be it for today! Um, tomorrow we're gonna play Bendy in the Dark Revival. Isn't that exciting? Do I have my badge on that lets me fucking own these guys? Beep, 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 beep. I freaking missed it. That's crazy that I did that just now. LMAO. Whatever. hard to do stylish moves sometimes because of like the the pressing button is a little difficult but I need to get money money from uh the other little star piece lady Yippee Good I am running low on EP juice <laughs> Oh, come on! I can't even kill this guy. That's so cringe. very uh girl boss of me to have done that that's what the kids say now right no they say phantom tax and ohio and skibbity toilet they say ohio riz guys okay i i my, my friend talked about this on stream and I saw it on my- I think I saw my Twitter feed, but I didn't watch it. Okay, so you guys have to tell me if this is real. Is there a skibbity Joe Biden? And is it produced by the Joe Biden team? Like, is that a- is that real? Or am I like... Like, I- in my heart of hearts, it's not real. No, okay, but there's a, there's a skibbity Joe Biden. Okay. I can accept that. I just, you know, I wanted to make sure it was not another Pokemon go to the polls type beat. So that's good at least. At least that bit of sanity is saved. <laughs> it was on cable TV. Now, now what do you mean by that, exactly? Now, now, elaborate on that real quick. Wait, what do you mean? Wait, what do you mean by that? It was on cable TV. Well, what? I'll cry.
I fucked up. On the Colbert Report. No. Why did that happen? That's silly. I don't know what you're talking about. I can't read. It's too late at night and I no longer can read, actually. God damn it. Now I understand how dyslexic people must feel. I just can't- I can't understand what you're saying at all. There's some mess- mess of lines and stuff. Guys, really interesting. Uh, he's not dyslexia, but actually just graphia. Wait, do I have coin finder? No, I have item hog. Wait, where the fuck do I get coin finder from? So this is what coping looks like. I know what you are referring to, to be honest with you. Um, but what I do know uh, is that I am now going to save and quit and end stream. I honestly thought I was going to end stream like early because I just like wasn't feeling it at all. But I love Paper Mario. All right, well, I'll see you guys tomorrow, you. Uh, let me just really quickly look at something. Anybody streaming at all? Anyone? No. All right, guys. Uh, I'm gonna go get headache medicine. Oh, and maybe eat for the first time today. That might be good if I do that. I just don't have any food, so. Well, whatever. Uh, see you guys tomorrow night. I don't think I'm gonna do an early stream. I'm just gonna do my usual night stream. Wait, no, I did on my did I put on my schedule that I was gonna do an early stream? Oh my god, I did. Oh, whatever. I'll see you guys fucking 1 p.m. Eastern time tomorrow. I guess for stream. I guess whatever, whatever.